Maybe. I would still consider those handouts. Hey, guys. I'm just coming on to say hello because I saw there's like apparently five people here. I don't know if that's true or not. Sometimes I don't trust YouTube. But I felt like if there are people gathered, I should probably say something. Otherwise, it's kind of rude on my part. That's a lot of people. And I do have some friends here, as you could probably hear. <laughs> I made Japanese curry, and I'm currently trying to brag about how good it is. But neither mm. of these other people here have had it before. Apparently, they're talking to the wrong people. Yeah. Yeah. There's just, you know, never been a, a time for it, really. I have very, very vanilla taste when it comes to food. Can you handle spice, Try? No. I, uh, I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, there's like a chicken place here, and they have the chicken ranked on spiciness from zero to seven, let's say. You're going to know where this goes. I get the zero. Oh. Every time. Uh yeah. Makes a lot of sense. One time they accidentally, like, served. I think it was probably level seven, and they labeled it zero. <laughs> I did not like that. Mm. I did not like that at all. I bet. Mm -hmm. I could probably go between six and seven regularly on, like, an enjoyable thing. If it's, like, a scale of one to ten... JPL might they, like, interrupt you it. to say that we have a pun in chat. <gasps> Hello, Vice. What's a pun? Not a common occurrence. I'm so unbelievably it. disappointed. Aww. I can't. <laughs> you can't see it in chat? I, I can't visualize the pun. I need to see it to figure out why it's a pun. Oh. Has it not occurred to you? Um. Yeah. Well, get yourself in chat. I'm looking. Occur yams. Mmm. But yeah, how are you doing today? We're embarking on Ota's route. Yeah, I actually had this labeled ahead of time. That's right, because I scheduled this. Occur yarns? You missed an R. I could tell what it was supposed to be, though. I approve. Yeah, just occurrence, but curry instead. Oh! <laughs> that took you too long. Oh my because god. Because it didn't look like curry! Mm. Oh well. Well. I was able to recognize it. I can't believe JPL didn't, though. And took a little too don't long. Don't judge me. Aw. Okay, we won't judge you. I don't want to put pressure on you like that. I cooked the food. I deserve. You did good. You deserve something. praise. There you go. Good J pedal. Yeah, I, I finished what I was up to, so I'm good. <laughs> I can now fully <laughs> invest in this. Well, good. I'm glad everyone has uh had a successful evening of cooking and eating and whatever else she may have been up to. We actually got the stream started list. pretty much on time. Checking that list twice. I was assuming yeah. you checked that list. Uh, yes. Well. I had to think about that. <laughs> Do you actually make a physical list or is this like on a phone or something or other device? Um, It's a mixture of having it on my phone. If I need to, I write it down on paper. And then I have one on my computer so I can check prices. Okay, that's very, very... Uh, what's the word for it? Advanced. That's clever. Detailed? Detailed, yes. It's necessary. That's you make Thorough. sure you can yeah. get everything you need. And for the best price. <laughs> You're having microwaved corn dogs? Uh, corn dogs are so good. I don't know what it is. I've never had a corn dog, but the name corn dog never has appealed oh, to me to make me try it. Try. I mean, I don't. It is think literally that... a hot dog battered and then fried. Oh, okay. It's like um on a stick. Yeah. I'm like using like cornbread around it, right? 
Mm -hmm. or something. You can, but you can also make um, like if you want to do it at home, you would use pancake batter. Oh, interesting. Uh huh. And like so on and so forth. But it's just, it's dough around a hot dog, and it's been fried. And then if they're microwaved, then they were the frozen kind. Yeah, I don't. could be the worst. Yeah. I don't think Possible my experience with frozen ones has been that great, just because like the texture of the breading yeah, can be really a little soft. bumpy. Yeah. Like there's little grainy bits in it. Um, mm -hmm. but the fact that it became a very popular Korean thing now, like there's Korean corn dogs that they put like they put like potato toppings around the dough or they put um, rice cake in, or sometimes like partially the hot dog and partially cheese, or like yeah. partially rice cake and partially cheese. Hmm. Um, now that I have better access to ones that have been made like just recently, those are really good. I would never nice. get a frozen one though. Um, like I like buying the packs of frozen ones and then like air frying or deep frying them a second time. Because uh, then you get either really crunchy or just like nice and toasty. Mini corn dogs, though, Willow, are where it's at. They're small. Oh, and they by taste the way, so good. Going off track on something different than food. I, uh, you know how you set up those events, J Pedal, and we did the, we had the one going for Yakuza, I guess it was. Yeah, Yakuza. Yeah. For some reason, it wouldn't go away the last one, and I had to like click like start the event and then like just end it manually. I don't know why. Wow, I was very That's confused. Weird. Because we had to adjust something with it. Mm, I guess it could have been it. This one seems to be planned normally. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, on Discord we have a whole uh, event system now, which actually works quite well. I figured out how to like also link to the YouTube video itself, so people just click that when they're. Uh... I use it to pressure try into streaming on time. It's yeah. been so pretty effective, I guess, team. right? I think it has. It, it doesn't really yeah. work making him on time, but it does make him stream the days that it goes. I was pretty much on time for this one. I mean, yeah. it was kind of yeah, this for, one. You know. yeah. <laughs> Who made curry? I, right. I finished my curry before 7.30. Technically, yes, but we we're still kind of talking at that point. It was 7.26 when I finished my curry. I know. It was plated. I I know. I know. It's okay. <laughs> no need to defend yourself. I was raised to defend myself against everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I finished consuming my curry by now, so oh, well we done. should play. I can switch on over to the game then. Let's see if this works. Game, are you working? Uh, yes, the game's working. That's uh, good. Oh, that's right. Are you going to share was... it with us, too? Yes, I was. But I was going to do first was uh, I had the webcam going, but now it's not working. Oh, I know why it's not working. Oh, no. Oh, no. How YouTube I... doesn't like your face. What broke. It doesn't. I know what it is. It's because I'm sharing on Discord. With... It's very strange. You can only have like one source at a time. All right. Let me see if I can figure this out on the fly real quick, which is never a promising thing, but. I'm going to see if this works. You know, you do that, I'm going to go and grab my drink. Oh, yeah, definitely. Have water. Oh, here we go. Now I'm on the stream. Hello, everyone. The only thing I have to do then is do the virtual OBS camera, which should be pre-configured. And then... This is what's supposed to go to Discord. Technically. Like so. Oh, and that works. Yeah, okay. Wow, that was actually not so bad. I just have to share this with you guys. And, uh... That should be that. This is actually pretty straightforward today. For troubleshooting. All right. Oh, hopefully I lit up the right save. I was just hitting, like, the button. Okay. No, Let's you see. hope. I'm trying I need to, make to sure. send something off 
for Discord and Discord. Well, that was OBS. unclear for a second, so you'll be alone for a hot second. Oh, uh, all right. Hey, what's up, guys? It's just you and me. It's just like an old school stream, right? No one. Oh God, if we have him, I don't like him. I kind of lied saying I liked him in the last stream, but clearly, I was a little bit more uncomfortable than I was letting on. Oh, you know, I'm just gonna adjust my windows here. Ooh. Oh, hello. Who Welcome did back. you feel like? That didn't take long. Oh, uh, or Mr. Well, friend I didn't finish my here. thing. I just heard you. Oh, that's right. You're always listening. That's uh, the, slightly the... concerning. So Our little taxi it, driver. Who? Taxi driver friend. Yeah, he's not very nice. He's got a face that his mom like and love. No one else. So, we were apparently just about to leave. But before we leave, let's get uh, one more look here real quick. Hi. I guess I can't. This is not fair. Very unfair. Oh well. Alright, well I'm just gonna wait for Onyx to get back. Just cause... I figure it won't be very long. And then we'll get ourselves out. To the world. Oh, we're going back to see So again. It's always fun. Let's see. What can I think about to talk about while uh, I'm waiting? Yeah. I don't know. What are the latest games you guys have been playing? J Pedal made me pretty much force me to buy Baldur's Gate 3, which, to be fair, I had actually been thinking about getting at some point before then as well. Actually, there were a couple of different points I thought about getting it. That might be one of the things we end up playing soon. Well, I'm not sure. I'm kind of intimidated by it. It's a big game. It's a big RPG. It's a lot to it, and I don't really play those kinds of RPGs. Um, just more of a. Uh -oh, just here we go. Do it. I know. Just, I just have to do, do it. it. It'll be yeah. suffering for me, I'm sure, but I'll get through it. I am sure it's gonna. Eventually, be suffering I'll for you. come to learn to love the suffering. <laughs> uh, no, it could turn you off. Like it does oh. require patience. Okay, that's that's a big ask for me for patience. I'm pretty sure Onyx has said just it's a play style that he would never like. So Really? That's what you said, Onyx? Yeah. <laughs> How I think about I... what? Baldur's oh. Gate 3. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That might be true. Not the same. Um, but yeah, I'm it's glad to hear you're enjoying the Stardew Valley. That's cool. I didn't know they had an update. Hopefully it's been a... This is a really recent update, too. It was like a couple of days ago. Hmm. Well, it is my duty to report that we are once again embarking to the Sejima residence, it seems. So let's go. These visits never seem to go very well. We've been told several times to stay off of this property. <laughs> oh, no only here. the kindest reception. Except a person is about to kill us. Wait, is there someone in there? Oh, no. Just a giant urn. Indeed. I don't see so or his bodyguards. Maybe they're all dead. I do not detect them either. Maybe. Let's go inside. Oh, and also, I'm assuming everything's working with the stream with the audio and everybody on it. Oh, yeah. Stu, tell hey, us if bye. things are too quiet or loud. Do you smell something funny? You are aware that I do not possess the sense of smell, correct? Oh, right. It's a slight problem. No, it's just you, Date. You're the one that's smelling funny. There's something strange about this vase. We haven't seen him shower the entire game, to be fair. Ugh. No, we what haven't. This is definitely where the smell is coming from. Oh, no. I don't oh, wait, like I this. Don't here for this. What could it be? Well, get back here then. Where are you? I'm here. Okay. I'm watching. Maybe, but the opening is covered by a metal plate. The lid is fixed with a bolt. For some reason. It will not open easily. What is it? Bolt? Yeah. Then, as is standard procedure. one was like, no flowers. <laughs> uh. I'm kind of scared here. Yeah, we know how to I look was, inside. My first thought was to kick it, admittedly. 
I would kick that too. Why not? A very boring house, if I may say so. Oh, they've chairs. We've been least. in here before. Remember? It was on this route. On no. uh, music keys. I know when we had the confrontation. Yeah, it was uh. Same house. Look here. around though. Oh, well, I know it's the same house. I just didn't. Yeah. Well, this guy just fell apart on us, I guess. <laughs> Destroy the base. No. Got it. I don't... It's gonna be a mess. He's already Can we it, just... It, like, doesn't matter. Can't we it's have a professional house. open this up for us? I don't want his parts no. flying out at us. I would just like to point out by saying a death so well earned. Hmm. 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 Hey, buddy. So Sejima. Notice how, like, super decayed and messed up his body. Yeah, he looks like he's been dead for a while. It's real weird. The, head of so the left eye is hollowed out. This is most likely a crime committed by the new Cyclops killer. I feel like we I... should have broken the base open first, though. <laughs> I am compelled to death. point out, because uh -huh. tries now to forget things, uh -huh. In uh, Mizuki's route, I believe. Hmm? Mizuki? No. It was... Yeah, in the Annihilation route. Mm -hmm. uh, after seeing that video of someone be being shot, Peter called us and said someone found his Amazing. body... It was a house in a, in a vase like this. Oh, they had yeah. some yeah. of that then. Okay. So consistent wow. deaths across all of the games. Like, who, whoever dies when, they have the same death, seemingly. I see. That makes sense. It just played out differently because of what we were doing. Yes. If you like listening to Patsy Klein for some reason, uh, what is, what is Patsy Klein saying? That sounds familiar. I need to look this up. What's her most famous song? Do you guys know? I... I'll take this now. <laughs> I vaguely know. I don't know okay. if she's the one who sang... I... Yeah, I fell to pieces. Oh, there we go. <laughs> nice job, Vice. Yeah. I feel like I actually like had a song of hers play recently on like something I was no well, whatever it doesn't matter anyway uh Today, yeah that's in town death between 11 a.m. and noon I sure paid attention to what time it was when we got here well, that's like about when I was talking to Ota at Matsushita recent Diner recent death mm-hmm at that time Mayumi was in police custody and Iris was in the ICU of Central Hospital they have okay. not moved that means Ota, Mayumi, and Iris couldn't possibly have committed the crime. Assuming that this is the work of a single killer, those three can be eliminated from the list of suspects. Ota, Mayumi, and Iris are not the new Cyclops killer. Right. By the way, why is there no one in the mansion? No bodyguards, no housekeepers. I do not know. Does So have family? So Sejima's no. wife died in labor 30 years ago, giving birth to their son. Oh. Their son is currently living abroad. So lived here alone? This is where I mentioned, in case you forgot, of course, in Mizuki's route, he called you his son. He called himself yeah. your father. Yep, that did happen. No, just... That's why I wanted to say when we shot open the vase, mm, daddy. Oh, no. you just had to say I was hoping it. we could avoid that word for this stream. We failed. Connect like me. five minutes in. <laughs> Date, the sync machine is up and running. You can sync with Mayumi now. Oh, good news, oh, Peter. Thanks, Peter. But there are more pressing matters now. But more importantly, yeah, I found So Sejima's body with the left eye hollowed out. What? I'm at the Sejima you know, household. Left eye hollowed out. 
Send the investigation team over. Why so? I can answer your questions the when I get back. Why so, so serious? Why so serious? rest. Aw, yeah. He looks very uncomfortable right now. Date, mm. what is your plan? Wait until crime scene investigation arrives? No. There's something I need to do. No, I've already that ruined uh, this investigation truth, site. Naomi so. was at the warehouse yesterday. And we know the chocolate we found at the scene was hers. Mm-hmm. Maybe she saw something. Maybe she knows something we don't. Some kind of clue or information about the culprit. Then... Yeah. We're gonna sink with Mayumi. We're gonna this sink with Mayumi. This will be up to the Mayumi. investigation team to handle. Yeah, you would kind of think that maybe they'd want to keep the urn as evidence not just have it destroyed immediately yeah oh well you very much ruined this crime scene <laughs> you've potentially damaged the body even more there's blood everywhere it was like there's uh, a the rush to like blood. open it up like we already know it was inside because we could tell <laughs> exactly we knew he was dead at that point call the team and be like i found his body oh maybe you could put him back together i don't know dante instead you tampered with the crime scene. Just a little bit of tampering. All right, Tuesday, 3 or 9 p.m. Whoa, Dante, look at her go. The investigation of Sosejima has already begun. At this very moment, the media is already swarming outside the building. Really? Couldn't keep a lid on it, huh? Doesn't matter. The sink is what's important. If we sink into Mayumi's brain, that might help us find the real culprit. I understand. Are you ready? Yeah. Then let's begin. I don't know if it would be considered a hardcore puzzle. I feel like it's kind of every Saw movie, really. Hmm. Pretty standard now. Did we see what's going on with Boss's Root? Uh, no, haven't seen her. Okay, interesting. Wow. It's a little bit bright inside here. Jeez. Where am I? Don't tell me this is the first time seeing your face. Is it your first time seeing my face? I don't know. <laughs> I guess you can a lot answer of that. Face cam stuff, actually. <laughs> yeah, lately I guess I have. Like these last few weeks. Yeah. Hello. Good to see you can make it, May. How you been? You got in time just in time for the sink. Um, yeah, what happened? I'm trying to think. Was it like two weeks ago? I was testing it with something, and then I accidentally left it on. And I'm like, oh, okay, I guess I'll just use this from now on. So, um, at about the a week. start of the Iris route. So, like, oh, yeah, that's two streams ago. Oh, yeah, you got you weren't here for the streams. You, uh, I had a little bit of a tinfoil hat thing going for a little bit there. Oh, yeah, <laughs> he wore a tinfoil hat for two streams. Oh, yeah, you got class early? I did get hurt slightly. But I'm fine. I'm okay. Yeah, well, good luck with uni. If you can't stay long, that's all right. We'll try to get through as much as we can. Oh, silly me. This is my house. Mm-hmm. Is your house always as bright, what? though? I... What happened to me? This is Matsushita Diner, though it looks... odd. Likely an effect of the dementia. Oh, so this is how it manifests. Then we need to help yeah. remind her. Do you think such a thing can be done? This oh, diner what? means everything to Mayumi. <laughs> well, she's if gone. We do what we did last time and reproduce the actions from Mayumi's memories. We could help her remember everything. Is this what you call your intuition? Told you it was useful. Yeah, you caught that. Well, if we must. Somnium All scan. Right. Activate. What were we saying in the chat about the puzzle thing on Onyx? Oh, uh Willow mentioned putting so together like a jigsaw puzzle. Oh <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Hardcore gotcha. jigsaw puzzle. All 
Oh, well, I guess we're gonna have to unlock Mayumi. Reproducing her past to invoke her lost memories. Take it, she's got a lot of memories lost. All right, let me look at the map first. Actually, I'll look at the chat as well. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. Because we were doing Mizuki, and then we ended up going switching over to the other side. Now we're back over, right? That's how it works. I see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, then I guess you came back at a good point. We played a little bit of Oda's Root before, but not too much. Yeah. And yeah, I yeah, just like thought... I, said, I think we might be at the halfway point. Yeah, I think... Uh... Yeah, because we did most of Iris's Root last time, and then just kind of like at the end we did this. I was going to say, I just also put things in like a playlist, so if you need to refer back to old streams, hopefully that makes things easier. I've been trying to be good about this now. Oh, um, yes. Do you have any theories? That would be really fun to know. Calendar. Okay, what do I have theories of? Um, well, I'm kind of lost. <laughs> That's fair. It's meant to be a confusing game. I'm kind of Unless confused. you pick up on the really small details. Um, Because the actual, like, big reveal, I'd say, is well hinted at. Yeah, I don't know who's, like, behind the killings. I don't... I'm wondering if it's, like, multiple people involved. But I'm not sure if it actually... I feel like that's a cop-out if it's multiple people involved. So I feel like it's probably one person. But I can't uh, put... Time... Uh-oh, okay. Uh, Timeline-wise, we've done up to the block of Annihilation on left. Mm -hmm. Um, We're doing Ota's route currently. We've completed Correct. Mizuki's route. On the right side, we have not even started the true ending, but we have completed Iris's. Yeah, I just realized there's actually a chart for this. Yep. There we go. So we've done almost everything. Oh no, we're even farther than the halfway point of Ota. Okay. Well, that's pretty good then. Yeah. Yeah, we got a lot done, apparently. But there's your block point. What and is that this? That is the start of the true ending. That's the true ending. Okay. All right. That actually makes it a lot easier. I'm glad I checked this. I forgot that we had this, but I'm like, oh yeah, there's actually a chart. Yeah. Oh yeah, it we spent a lot of time with that. Iris. We did all that stuff. It was tragic. I was really sad at the end there, actually. You did, you did get quite sad. It was I, very I did, emotional. Yeah. And very tinfoil hatty. Yeah, very hatty. Um, I was gonna say though, for theories, like, I, cause I don't, like, almost everyone feels like they've died at some point, so I'm like, who would the actual killer be? Like, in one of these routes or another, like, like, who hasn't, well, I didn't mean to go here. Like, I'm thinking about who hasn't, hasn't died? died. Uh, like, Pewter, Mizuki, mm -hmm. Moma. Boss hasn't died. Yeah. Boss hasn't died. We haven't died. And obviously us, the main character, yeah. We could be blacking out and killing everyone without us knowing. Maybe it's a little bit like Secret Window. Has anyone seen that movie? Oh, yeah, that's a classic. Okay, cool, cool. Just making sure uh, that that's not okay. That's a Johnny Depp but one, But right? also, mm -hmm. okay. I want to say special mention to Rear Window. Love that movie also. Well, that's an old one. Yeah, that's a, that's a classic. Also right? a classic, though. Yeah. Also a classic. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's see what the date is, I guess. Oh, well, we might get Sometimes a good time. Sometimes I think about rewatching Secret timing. Window. Reads two months ago. Oh, all right. Two months ago. Oh. I meant to check out the wall clock, actually. There we a go. Wall clock. The hands have stopped. No, oh, we're just getting thirties. Well, maybe we'll get a big one the at some point. Door at the entrance. Who could that be? Leave us alone. We get two times uh, on the next one. I wonder if we have to do that though. Who, uh, who could that stature belong to? Who could it possibly be? Well, they look short. It looks like they're wearing a hat. So I believe. I could do uh, this. Clearly, from, uh, it's Iris. Memory. I think it's Oda. It's Iris. Yeah. Yeah. 
Who could that be? Would we tell him to leave? I don't think we should tell him to leave. My gosh, welcome back. Yeah. Let's uh we'll use one of these tinies for this. Use a tiny. Welcome back. It's Ash Ketchum. Of course. Close oh, enough. Crossover. Welcome back. Oh, he could be though. Today. I could see it. I'm home. He's trying, definitely. Are you he not wants to be the very best. Today's dinner is on the or taco rice. anyway. Your favorite. Dad isn't back yet, but you can start eating. Oh. Again. I'm okay. I ate already. But. I'm fine. Uh, Ota, wait. I've got MMOs to play, Mom. I have, you know, to go and be a degenerate in my off time. Oh no. Is Takara the dad? Is that the guy I made yes. fun of? Has manifested. Oops. <laughs> Maybe this is one of the <laughs> memories she forgot. He has an interesting face. Must I'll just say that much. Her, I'll keep it to that for now. No, don't mock him. <laughs> Pretty sure we're going to see him here. Oh. Doesn't matter if it's sad. It's still important. I don't know. I may have said a few things about his picture, about his face. I don't. I uh, don't recall. I'm gonna plead the fifth. Uh, let's look around first. Oh, the beer poster. Hmm. An old beer poster. Looks like me when I was young. I could use a beer. <laughs> is this? I'm assuming this is Iba saying this. Iba, when were you ever um, young? Uh, you're supposed to be reliving Mayumi's memories. Oh, this is Mayumi thinking this. Yes. Let's see what happens if Mayumi says this. This sure. one is not necessarily not necessary. Oh, I didn't think adult. it was. Um, I was yeah. just kind of curious. Something is a bit off this woman and mayumi they are not you know no i don't see much of a resemblance well, between the two in the ad and mayumi looks like a sea creature so date date <laughs> oh it's very my rude. dude okay well we got a one Agent date, you've over time so that's many. pretty good thank you for the uh, update pewter Probably shouldn't waste too much time. Let's come up with a new menu. I wonder if that's something they did at some point. Oh, oh there he is. I'm sure he was a lovely man. It's the phone. I bet he was. It up? Roger. I mean, it's probably not her husband calling. This probably after he's already deceased. But she doesn't know that. Yeah. She believes he's still alive. Let's reduce this down a bit. My husband. Yes, Matsushita Diner. Yes. Well, yes. Oh, well, that really is sad. What? My, my husband. But unfortunately. <laughs> oh, this is when it happened. Yeah. Oh. You are just, like I said, reliving her, like. Really? The worst memories. Big memories. Yeah. I know. I wasn't thinking for the guy in general, just his, his looks. Which I guess is, is mean. However, but still. These memories aren't all happy. But they are all significant. If this continues, will it In fact, the first two memories we've memory seen memory? are both not good. No. Maybe. But we have to see this through. <laughs> we all laughed at his looks. We have to. Did you laugh, Jay Petal? Or what about you, Alex? Understood. I don't remember if I laughed, but I do remember commenting that he looked really weird because he didn't fit into the art style. No. I. I didn't laugh at him. I was playing alone. Oh, you're very serious when you play. You don't laugh long or have reactions. I I have more crying at reactions when I play alone. Aww. 
That's it. I guess we're gonna call Oda over. I guess I'll use the half of this. This is pretty significant. <laughs> Stopped at five minutes. <laughs> All right, then that's yeah. kind of like my reaction at that point, May. Yeah, no, he also had the pause. That's fairly, and just... that's very accurate. Ota, come over here. Ota, Ota, a girly magazine came in the mail. Is oh. this for Ota or for Dad? Well, this is awkward, but there's no reaction. Oh, I didn't bring him over. I tried my no. best. It's not as bad as. Date is apparently about these magazines. Sometimes it's good to recheck the area as well. Okay, uh, sometimes new additions get added. Dante, Ooh, we have a cake. Four okay, Delicious okay. Cake. Let's try to stay focused. Maybe there's a birthday where we had some kind of event happen. Oh, I wonder whose birthday it was, though. Push her face in it. Wait, did that happen? It was mine. Give me it was cake. yours. Well, Give me cake. It's not. Happy birthday, J Pedal. Don't. It's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> the cake is a lie. Who had the, who has the closest birthday from here? Let's uh, see. I don't know. When's your birthday? Mine's in uh about two weeks. Are, are you actually. asking? Oh, then yeah, it's yours you. is closest. I know. I kind of said that expecting that it would be me. <laughs> I'm terrible. <laughs> Onyx is November. I'm December. Oh, really, May? I just beat you then. Yeah, April 9th is mine. Oh. So I just slightly I, uh, ahead of you. I won't be wishing you a happy birthday, but mm. now I know. I will <laughs> maybe note it down to wish you a happy birthday if you don't mention it in the Discord. Okay. I'm going to take note if you say it or not. Okay. And I will hold it against <laughs> you forever. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I mean, you totally could. I have an awful memory. Feel free to use against me. You know who you're talking to, right? Yes. I have the worst. Well, happy future birthday to you, May. I'll probably remember. I almost forgot Maybe. that we had this stream. It's not too far. Oh, really? All right. Are we doing one of these birthday options? Or we have, uh, we have something else to do? What else do we have here? Well, the only other new thing is a bucket it's and autograph. an autograph. Those don't seem too significant to me. A delicious cake. Birthday seems important. Do you think this is, or whose celebration is it? Do you think this is maybe after his death or before? Well, I'm assuming this would be after the father's already passed. I'm assuming he's in chronological order. Well, maybe that's wrong. Maybe her mind is kind of, it would be switched around. Hmm. I, w I was going to say Otis, though. That was my guess. Go for it. Go for it? Okay. Well, I, okay. I'm I'm properly encouraged, so let's go for Oda. Congratulations, Ota. I'm home. <laughs> In short summary for your ADHD brain. I was talking about this with J Pedal and we were talking about the uh ADHD thing kinda of being in a spectrum. Isn't that right, J Pedal? Was I talking about that with you? Uh, yeah, like a sliding yeah. scale. It's a yeah, it's a scale. Ota. Oh, there he is. He vibrates. So Congratulations on getting into the university, son. Congratulations. Oh. Uh, also, May was specifically asking about your theory because she'd forgotten what you said already. Yeah, what's oh, your my theory. theory? Oh, oh, my theory was I, uh, I, I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he doesn't I, have one. I don't have a concrete theory. I was trying to pin who it was. I'm, I was thinking about like, okay, like who hasn't died on any of the routes so far? And like, oh, we, we um, kinda... 89 has been introduced and not died. 89, yeah, he has not died. Supposed to be um, in prison all this time, though. So that's kind of a. Computer. Makes it complicated. Boss. Mm hmm. Uh, Mizuki, Mizuki, Mama, you, and Mama. Yeah. It's all on Mama. And Mama. Mama. Just giving I us information, but also killing people behind the scenes. <laughs> but I, I thought I heard Mama and not Moma. Mama. Did you say Mama both of them just like. Mama? I heard both of them. Oh. I will okay. vouch for Onyx, yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you. The nurse. Oh, there's also the breast behind the desk. You know what? She she kind of gives me Junko vibes a oh. little bit. It could be her. She yeah, but she's in her 30s. So, like, she doesn't oh. have the teenage uh, uh, chaos energy yet. Wait, are we implying uh, that this is like... a, a younger person doing the killing? 
Jethro. No, I'm just saying she's not Junko. Okay. She doesn't have no, no. the, like the yeah. teen insanity. Like, it's mid thirties insanity instead. Yeah, yeah. No, no, that's it. I just can't say that about I mean, anyone with visible cleavage. I just did though. <laughs> you do have a point. She does feel a little bit like specifically mm -hmm. anime Junko. Yeah. <laughs> it's shaking and I your do head mean at me. that as an insult. <laughs> oh. Uh, I like her. No, there's like a specific version of Junko that talks like that too in the uh, in the game, I believe. She's just like, I don't know, 13 yes. personalities. Yeah. Blonde, boobs, and weird. That just screams Junko. <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry to tell. I'm so sorry, Mayruma. I'm so sorry. Aww. Well, she has large plot. It just may not be plot relevance, exactly. Yeah. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> oh, look at that hat. That is sweet. Were you the one talking about Fantasia the other day, j Pedal? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I thought so. I assume she might have been talking about so it for much class. Despair. Ota was quite the spoiled child, wasn't he? He definitely had a lot of growing up to do. But that's what Oh, I'm so Onyx. I'm the one who told you I'm so sorry. Oh, that's right. Uh, did I have it? Yeah, it should work now. Um, if you look in the top left, there should be little speaky things for everyone who's speaking. Wait, is are the names actually uh, fully up there? Hold on. I was no. gonna say, are they visible? Oh. It only says oh, the J and J pedal's name for some reason. I think. Um, my name lights up, I'm on the very bottom. It's uh the little flower. Yeah, I got that because you mentioned it, and I was like trying to damn this to get that to actually work. It took me so long to figure that out. <laughs> it was actually yeah. really simple too, it's just I couldn't figure out Discord for the longest time. But yeah, I'm glad I have that now. Now people can tell easily. It's helpful. Who? So it tries on top, J pedals in the middle, and I'm on the bottom. Uh, and I'm Spider Lily in red. And <laughs> J pedals got Edgeworth. That's right. It does show a little bit of the avatar, too. Cool. Yeah. Alright, what am I doing now? See, something probably. Sh oh, an envelope. There we go. I was going to say, Pete, uh, things are showing up, and I'm not paying it's attention to them when they do. Some kind of mail? Yeah, that's why I said uh, top to bottom wise, because I also realize the names are not really visible. When do you ever pay attention? Sometimes. Occasionally. I have my moments. <laughs> yeah, you just choose moments. Just few and far between, huh? <laughs> Let's burn it and throw it away. <laughs> you probably shouldn't forget about it. It looks you like want a bill. The actual answer. For some reason, I remember this all. Yeah, sure. This is what I'm confused about, to be honest. Let's do our best. Yeah, I don't know why you can't read the names. Like for me, it just says T. For J Pill, it just says J. I don't know why for for uh, Onyx it actually says the whole spider lily. Like I don't why? Know. It sounds like they changed my name. I don't know why that says that. And like for me, it's just abbreviated. Is my name just too? Um, also, I think mine it's... is like the same length as yours, though. Kind of. It's Close just enough. like kind of low quality, unless you're like in full screen and on like the highest <laughs> HD setting. <laughs> Damn it, May! I'm role playing Mayumi's mind. That's just me in general. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. I just have a very uh. Oh, oh, oh I get it. You get it? Yeah, yeah. Early onset dementia. Try. Mm. Yep. Yeah. Oof. Speaking of which, what were you saying, J Pedal? Because I got to. <laughs> let's do our best! Alright, let's do our best. Yeah. Of course. Uh, hmm. Our best, right. Let's do our best. I forget what I'm saying so often. It's just embarrassing. <sighs> Trying to absorb this is a very sad moment, too. Can you absorb all the tears too? We have to keep supporting Ota. Okay. Aww. We'll work harder for Ota's dream. I 
They worked so hard for Oda, and then just goes and spends all the money on his figurines and donating to Iris, I guess. <laughs> Whatever he's doing. Dropped out of university during this time. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. A lot of time. Please share any clips you take, Nano. We reproduced another painful memory. Oh yeah, if you guys are making clips, be sure to put on Discord or whatever. No, not quite. Use it against me as blackmail. Are you certain? Mayumi was under a heavy burden of debt and stress running the diner. That's true. But sometimes hardship is worth it. Is that so? Huh. You don't have permissions to post in the clips channel? Wait, why not? I thought that Do you need was permissions to post there? I don't know. I uh I apologize if I've not given you the proper permit permissions. <laughs> yeah, how could you how could you <laughs> it do feels that so terrible? Him? Um Wait, I thought that there was that just J Pedal posting them before? Because I mean that would make sense that you're able to do a J Pedal. Uh, no, May Ruma also posted I Oh May did. May doesn't have a special role, I don't think. Did I give you a special role? Well, other than for the Why would game thing. May have a special role. She literally just joined. I know. Well, I did for because I gave Nano Trites and May the thing for the game channel group thing. Because you're both secret Hitler peeps who know how to play that. So I'm like, yeah, you guys can join in. Um, You'd love to have a special role? I mean, technically people can request colors. I have been pretty uh, accommodating for giving people their color choices on Discord in the past. Yeah, that's true. You're very nice with oh colors. Oh my gosh, welcome. someone has just been privately shamed, and it is such an atrocity. Wait, who has? <laughs> I feel cold out. I said privately. Uh, yeah. It's private. I feel concerned now. If it was public shaming, then I would just share it on stream to make it more public, but no, it's private. But the, I'm feeling the shamer. Like, I'm feeling so cold out right now. I'm not, yeah, okay. Anyway, um, really not. Oh, that's funny, surprised. actually. <laughs> I, I'm worried. <laughs> oh, no, don't in. worry about it. Okay. Like, it, like, seriously, like, it, it's, it's nothing to do with you. Oh. I mean, I don't technically mind calling myself out, I guess. Uh if you call yourself out, no one else can do it for you. That's true. I mean, I but I was I... already not going to do anything, so like you don't have to. Yeah. Anyway, I was just going to say, Natrus, I think you should be able to post in there. Um, give it a try. If you can't, I'll probably fix it later tonight. Um, otherwise, if you can make a clip, just like save it for, save like the link somewhere, and I'll. Uh, He'll make fix sure. it tonight. <laughs> Jesus, unless Nattrice. if he watches. <laughs> what did? <laughs> Tries a lot of skeletons so in his skeletons. closet. I mean, oh, you, I was gonna say, no idea. We have a thing for skeletons he'll, in this game, don't we? It's hard to. He'll fix it tonight. He'll fix yeah, it we like tonight our unless I make him watch more uh, weird cinema. Then he'll just pass out right away. I'm being made to watch cinema now, apparently. Yes. Skeletons? Oh, yes. We have all the skeletons, just a collection of them. Yeah, he's got boners I'm, in his closet. No. <laughs> anyway, uh, back to the game. Moving on. <laughs> uh, right. There was something else I was going to say, but now I'd... Okay, well, I'm just going to get back to the game. Because I can't remember now. It was very on brand. thing did you realize, May? Is it me? Yeah, I try is pretty sad. <laughs> A bucket. Oh, a bucket. Uh, a delicious bucket. Oh, right, because you haven't finished your game yet. Aw. Um, well, that's okay. The stream will be saved forever if you ever want to go back to it after you're done with it. It'll always you be get an achievement if you wear this one. bucket. Mm, it's going to cost us a lot of time, though. I guess yeah, I it's not necessary. 
That's you just an achievement. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. I'm going to okay. do it. Okay. We'll risk things for the bucket, for the achievement. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. A buck. Let's wear it. Let's wear it. Yeah, if we're wearing the bucket. I Come on. Wear it. Roger. Soup. Wearing it, I suppose. I feel as though my defense power has gone up. And? I am impervious to telepathic interference. Ah. You're afraid. I remember. This is like you with the tinfoil. Almost. Yeah. I was gonna say I somewhat like similar. That's what I was gonna say too. We That's all scary. Have a single brain cell. We're all on the same wavelength now. <laughs> but streaming too long together. It was a tin foil. <laughs> May I instead have the brain cell to myself? It's a sticker no. from a chocolate candy. I mean, we Red might have drink. one all between us. I don't think I'm contributing very much, to be fair. Welcome home. Did you get it? Oh, young me? Oda. I think I steal That's it cute. half the time. <laughs> it? Possibly. This is Oda when he was small. Well, everyone was I'm in some classes. Because you're what? Because I'm in classes. Oh. That's that's why I stole oh, it. Anyways. God, this is not working out well for us. This is a lot Look of time. Look what you did. Just cause the, wait, can I? Oh, God, I can't get out of here. I was going to try to do like another action instead, but... Hmm. Anyways, hmm. it's chocolate. Yeah. Yeah, but I'll have to reload anyway. I'm gonna have to reload. I think you. Yeah. We're not gonna have enough time after this. Yeah, Odoroki man, remember? Oh, that's just how he stands. Yes. Always. Of course, I bought it. He oh, stands like he has to go pee. Man, chocolate that you like. Here you go. No, no, no. That's not it. Oh, honey, I thought you liked the Momonoki man chocolate. No, I told you. It's Odoroki Man. Hmm. Oh. Sorry. Your mom can be such a dummy sometimes. Yeah, it kind of spoiled, but in a different way back then, I guess. It's at least more understandable because he's a child and not yeah, a grown like, adult. He's like, what, four, five, six then? You're not just a dummy. You're a super dummy idiot. Probably closer well, to like right, six or seven. I'm sorry. I'm a big yeah. dummy. I can never tell ages with these uh I'll buy you a real Mayumi here though. She just is like, You're right, I am a dummy. Yeah, she's not it's pushing like, back him at all. It's and he just keeps going like, on. Not, it's it's not good. You gotta you gotta tell your kid when they're doing something wrong. Mm-hmm. I hate this. I hate you, Mom. Aww. Like, I just can't Wait, blame Oda? her here. Uh, where did you go? Like, she she really can't fully realize. Like, oh, that was... Uh, please. There's, like, out, a really Oda? dumb mix-up. But, like, my brain is just not keeping track of the words Oda? enough, so... Yeah. Mommy won't make any mistakes anymore, Ota. That's a good observation, May, yeah. Back. And then he's kind of treating Iris for the same way, where he's, like, expecting all this from her in this, like, weird kind of relationship they have. Yeah, I can see that. he never learned anything else. He thinks he just, like, get that out of her. Like, this weird, like, kind of online... Well, I mean, it's also in real life, too, I guess, but, like, it's mostly, like, an online parasocial relationship in a way. Yeah. Like, all that shit he did with, the, like, multiple accounts, that was so weird. Trying to get what he wants from it. Ota? Taka, don't leave me. Aww. Don't leave me alone. I, I, I am sorry, Ota. Ota. Takaro, I can't do this on my own. Don't leave me! <laughs> Nanotrites! <laughs> Oda's lost in the sauce. God. 
Yeah. She's doing a good job of this scene. I agree. Oh, yeah. I, for as sometimes weird or dumb as this game can get, I will give full credit to the VAs, especially in the dub, because dub voice actors usually do not go this hard. Mm -hmm. They do such a good job during the emotional scenes. They fully play into their characters. Yeah. Well, it's not what I've done. It was what past memories. If Mayumi wakes up after all this trauma, I would kind of bring it out in her. And yeah, okay, I think I see. I know it's risky, though. but we're here for a reason. What are you planning? We have to keep going, just a little more to awaken her past. But. If she loves her family this much, there has to be something. There has to be a precious memory hidden deep within. Is that your intuition? It is. Wow, that's a lot of time. All right. So should we just reload now because of that? We only have like 40 seconds. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's the last decision. Okay. Wall clock, and that's all we have. Okay, that's all you have. Then I but guess you, we might be. You're getting options with it. Turn back time or advance time? Hmm. Oh, this of it. That actually works really well. What do you think is more healthy for her? She has to move on. She can't just stay trapped in her past. Good point. That's literally what dementia does to you too. Yeah. It's like, yeah, that's unfortunate, but. But also, yeah. admittedly, yeah. you're not trying to get her past memories. You need what just happened. Mm-hmm. We gotta move ahead. All right, let's go. And everything goes supernova. Ota, sweetie. Mom, I... Uh... I... Uh... Huh. We know we can be a hassle sometimes, so... <laughs> huh. Ota! Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, thank you, Mom. <laughs> You know, I, I love you forever and ever. Aww. Me too, Ota. It like really sucks when you see this memory though, and then you think of I like how he treated her so for a couple much. of years. Mm-hmm. I love During you. What were no definitely her what. hardest times. Oh, forever and ever. Oh, oh, I'll never forget this. <laughs> the one thing that never changes in her memory is the constant need to protect Ota. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's good knowing that she still has this memory. Looks like it's okay to go back now. Yes. I agree. By the way, Date. Hmm? I admit, it is useful every now and then. What is? Your intuition. I haven't been using that word a lot lately, haven't we? It's the theme all of this group. All you've really got as a detective. Dotsay's intuition. His intuition is having Reika's work schedule. 
if I go to the cabaret club today, Reiko will be working. Damn it, Jay. I don't really think that's intuition <laughs> so much as that it's stalking. Kind mm. of. Yeah, a little stalking. Yeah, it is sad. It's like her best memory, something that's from so long ago. But I guess that's kind of life in general, too. Like, at some point, a lot of your, you know, memories in life are in the distant past. Yeah, Hopefully. I also think it's important to acknowledge that um, it's not just her best memory of Ota. It's probably her best memory when her family was still whole. Yeah. It was her son and her husband. When everything was still whole in her life, yeah. Which is tragic, still. Ota, I'm so sorry for worrying you. What do you mean? Your mother retracted her confession. Oh, I'm so glad. Yes, yes. But mom, why did you think I did it? About that. I explained to Oda. On Sunday night, Mayumi was following the van driven by Oda in a taxi by a very, very fancy taxi driver. But when the van was hijacked in Famisto parking lot, Mayumi was at a, another convenience store nearby, buying some chocolate. Because of that, she didn't see what happened. And that's why Mayumi thought Oda was still in the van when it drove away. So she kept following it. The van drove all over Tokyo and eventually wound up in the warehouse district near the docks. Mimi got out of the taxi and followed the van on foot. The van was later found at Okiora Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse, that famous, famous place. Mimi walked into the warehouse and discovered the grizzly scene. That wasn't a grizzly bear, that was a polar bear. Incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that one coming. Hmm. So predictable, huh? I was so terribly frightened. I panicked and ran. I'm sure that's when I dropped the chocolate. And I ran away from it's the It's like a weird thing to see. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. I just kept running and running. But while I was running, I had a thought. Maybe that polar bear was Ota. Because at the time, I thought Ota was the one driving the van. If Ota brought Iris to the warehouse, then Ota must have been the one in the suit. That's what I was thinking, anyway. I see. So that's why. So is it confirmed that the polar bear plucked out the eye at the scene of the crime before the before live stream? Before the live stream. Yes. In this okay. timeline, at least. I'm so sorry that Mom doubted you, Ota. No, no, I understand. But like, um, it's my fault from what we can tell worry. based on how the bodies are when we find them, most of the eyes are plucked out, usually at the scene of the crime, mm -hmm. or while they're being murdered. It, well, it's while they're being murdered, wherever that might it's be. It's always plucked out pre-mortem, not mm. post. Yes. Mm. While they're being killed. It's more pleasant right that way. Mm. They're still living when it's plucked. Why and she, she had murder, to be killed the on eye screen. Eye. I wonder if there is a reason for that. I don't know. It's a good question, actually. Why did they, they start get a there? reaction out of Date, little binge? Otherwise, the the player wouldn't know at all. Yeah. If the eye plucking is seemingly sort of um. Just yeah, like but... a, a way to gather something. So it doesn't need to be streamed. It just needs to happen. I guess. Gotta just collect it, you know? Yeah, I was thinking from like the standpoint of like eyeball the most soup. extreme thing would eyeball be like eye street would be live streaming the eye plucking. Like cause that would just be pretty fucking hardcore. But yeah, I guess that wasn't the really. point of it. Because it, once more, eyeballs real easy to remove. It's a quick process. See This is not where I think the average mind jumps to. <laughs> Onyx. Would you uh like to question being friends with Onyx for a second? I, I'm so sorry, but this I, is just what you have to get used to. I I I am kind of used to it. So <laughs> when you say that, I'm just like, hmm. 
What have you been exposed to? Why? <laughs> a lot. Um, I'm an mm. avid fan of horror and mystery, so. Yeah. Um, a little too I, avid. <laughs> I'd say it's a good line of thinking, May. But think of it more as. I think it's a good it's question. A bit I was cooler too. to stream someone dying and acknowledging that you cannot do anything to help them. Oh yeah, no, I get someone that. Can live I understand that hundred percent. But I just meant like, Try yeah. You get so it's like the live stream is purposely for like us and like for our, uh, our terror, or uh, well, our anyone who's process. investigating the crime too. Anyone who's like, investigating, yeah. It'd be like think, man, man, also, man, man, what, you basically what I'm saying is like if, if it was just for like someone in general, for like, let's just say it was for like the fans who like or subscribed to her or whatever, like they'd be <laughs> terrified just seeing her eye removed. But it was more about like the right. helplessness on our part. So that's interesting. Okay. Because the thing that was mentioned already is Dante has made the connection. Everything they all have in common is that they are close to him. Yeah. So he is the target. And it is worse to have someone die in front of you, or you can watch it happen but can't stop it, versus just someone getting their eye gouged out. Hmm. Hmm. And that's true, man. Yeah, if they were streaming earlier, it would have been a better chance for us to stop it. Good point. Yeah. Would have given a lot more time because he like the also seems to um just like keep the eyes. We haven't found any of them. No, we haven't. That's why I was saying eyeball soup. But there's mm. one thing I, I know, get. I was trying to ignore the chance of eyeball soup. <laughs> Anyways, uh, try now. You know why it was so because. easy for me to fill the Onyx role playing mm -hmm. Coffin of Andy and Lele the other day. I've talked a lot the about Onyx this role? stuff with you. You mean what was the Onyx role? Talking about if something is accurate to how people can actually die or be dismembered. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see what you mean. But like, I watched True Crime mm -hmm. on my own. I had a good basis for that already. Just like part. It was partially refined by Onyx's influence. Okay. Like I, I still could have done that alone. Just yeah. maybe a little less detail. Gotcha. Gotcha. Mm. With you liked Shoko Man being Shoko kind of a loose young, connection, right, Shoko is Mizuki's mom. Yeah. You directly damage Mizuki by killing her. And yeah. Mizuki is the closest person to Dante. Yeah, she was pretty seriously affected by that. In fact, it was almost... Yep. It was almost like that death was intentionally to traumatize Mizuki with the way she was summoned to the park like that. Yeah. <laughs> like her in kind mm -hmm. of a risky spot and it puts Date on edge. Yeah. Because it, it would directly get him involved. Date's always on edge yeah. when danger is around. I was like the number one or two mm. collector of the stickers in my elementary school well, class. Well, the point is. I stuck some of my duplicates all around the diner, too. You and Mayumi have strong memories of that chocolate, right? Yeah. But I guess they're not all sweet memories. They're like chocolate, you know? Bittersweet. Makes my heart hurt a little. Oh, that's not the first time I heard life is like a box of chocolate. Mmm, you never know what you're gonna get. That's <laughs> it. Oh, honey. Unless you poke your finger through the tops. Yeah, and they have a little cheat sheet usually to say like what's what. So for the empty I eyes. You like the <laughs> Man chocolate. No, I told you. Oh, what? oh the Roki Man. The Odoroki Man. Oh, sorry. It's all just you're chocolate, my dude. Such a dummy sometimes. You're not just a dummy. You're a super dummy idiot. Oh well, you're right. Like I get he's just getting it because he wants to collect the stickers, but like it dummy. is just chocolate, my dude. Yeah. I'll buy you a real Momonoki man soon. Uh-oh. Stupid. It's not Momonoki man. It's Odoroki man. All right, Odo, we know, we know. After I This would make me really mad as a kid too, though. I mean, yeah, I was going to say like I'd probably be the same way as like a stupid kid. I mean, yeah. I I'm still like that of just like no, it's this, not that. <laughs> My dad came back from buying some ingredients at the same time, and they ran into I've each other. I've definitely done that before, but I was also pretty, like, corrected pretty quickly on that. Like, that's not a thing you can say. Mm-hmm. 
My dad really let me have it. Oh, oh no, wait till your dad gets home. How dare you speak to your mother like that? Because mom is stupid. Oh, you little shit. You're about You're to get told. To call your mother stupid. Oh! <laughs> yeah, call that kid an idiot. No, you're stupid. <laughs> Not sure if that's like the best it's instructional way, move. but sure. Your mother bought you that to make you happy. Aww. That's not what that subtitle says. Feels. I didn't raise you like that. But, but... When she comes back, you apologize. Do you understand? Aww. My dad told me to apologize as soon as mom came back. Yeah, I see what you mean. He is a good but dad. The guilt. I hurt my mother, you know? That guilt in my heart. It didn't go away. Even after I apologized to her. Yeah. After that, that's how it got is. Awkward with mom. But a few days later, my dad came up with an idea. Hey, Ota. How about this? Damn, his voice got deep. You know Mother's Day is coming up. Why don't we get a gift for your mom? Hmm? A gift? That was the first time I had ever heard my dad say something like that. You know how mom always takes care of us. Mm hmm We should think of a way to pay her back. That sounds like a good idea, Dad. I'm sure my dad was trying to clear the air between all of us. <laughs> so, on Mother's Day, I used my New Year's money I saved up to buy my mom that flower knife. And my dad saved up a little money to buy the floral apron. No. And when mom got her gifts, she started bawling. Like, full-on crying. I stand by. One day I'd like to <laughs> maybe get my mom a specialty knife. Oh, yeah. She likes cooking. Aw, oh, that'd be cool then. Yeah. You would still accept the chocolates? I mean, I'd accept the chocolates too. Yeah, I'm not picky. Especially because, yeah. like, yeah, it's good intentions. She bought it because she thought it was the correct one. <laughs> I don't deserve all this. Thank you, thank you. You do deserve it, Mom. I'm proud that you're my mom. Aww. You maybe deserve a better child right, altogether. Dad? <laughs> oh, um, uh, yes, mom is the best mom in the world. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Say cheese. Aww. Not one of them had their eyes open for the photo. <laughs> It means you don't blink Sorry. midway through. Uh, I guess so. I lost That's one strategy. What were we talking about again? The Odoroki Man chocolate. Yeah, remember that? Why she bought the chocolate in the middle of tailing you. Tailing? Yeah, it's what we call in the business. Mom. It could be due to her memory disorder. It is possible that her thought process was once again short-circuited. Ota, I'm just going out on a limb here. Huh? Earlier I looked inside Mayumi's head. Inside her head? Yeah, yeah it's you know, complicated. That's what I do. <laughs> she was thinking of nothing but you. Her head was full of memories of you. Most of them not good. Yeah. You... Weren't the best in those memories, but she still loved Mayumi you. Mayumi just wanted you to come back, Ota. So she bought that chocolate. The chocolate you loved as a kid. She thought she could get you back home with it. That's why I believe... In Mayumi's head, you're still young, Ota. You still also look young. <laughs> huh? Yeah, you she's still pretty young looking. I don't know. I could be wrong. No, you're right, Date. That's why my mom bought the chocolate. She wanted her little kid back. Oh.
trying to bring the Oda cat home. <laughs> I don't know if he makes a good cat. I'm sorry. Who are you again? I'm Date. I'm Ota's friend. I guess don't we're lie. friends. Don't lie. Sure. Ota's <laughs> yeah. friend. You know what? Right? It'll make her comfortable. It'll yeah. make her think her son's not a loser. Yeah, he's not just friends with one idol he talks to all the time. <gasps> on. And a 12-year-old. And the 12 year old there. He, she probably thinks he's the same age as the 12 year old, then, based on like what they're saying. Oh my gosh. There's a cat that desperately wants into my room right now. I'll let that cat in. I will let him in. Oh, I just have two cats over here curled on the bed. Aw, the sunset's beautiful. Cat, he's let loose, as in he's in the room. Man, he's pulling the crap. Kagame stunt? Kagame. What's the Kagame stunt? Kagami? Oh, oh that Kagami. guy. That's right. Who are you? <laughs> I didn't know his name. That's why I was confused. I forgot his name. I just want to know why you read it like that. <laughs> I don't know. Kagami, 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 Kagami. Kagami, 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 Kagami. Ooh, it's an x-ray for the bed. Oh, is he, is he hiding something under the bed again? A bed. Nope, it's just a bed. Oh, I can't. I've been well, Thankfully, the he's face not holding a knife tail. this time, I guess. <laughs> You're joking. I'd be really scared if he had a knife again this time. Like, why are you trying to stab Where me would now? Where have gotten it from? Good question. Just always keeps a knife in his boot. You never know you're going to need it. I was Specifically so a boot. Selfish. He only wears running shoes. No running shoes would work too. I made my mom go through such hard times. Then what is he doing with that hand of the bed now? Try it's a good question. <laughs> so from now on, I'm going to support her the way she supported me. Aww. I'll do anything. I'll deliver newspapers or be a janitor or anything. I'll work as hard as I can to make sure my mom can rest easy. <laughs> What about your dream of being an author? Well, of course I'm not going to give up on that. But I'll set my sights a little smaller. I'll start by writing a short story. Or a fanfic. Let me read it when you're done. As most authors do. Mm -hmm. Of course. But there is hardly an author that comes out swinging with a full-fledged novel. Maybe he's going to write a story about Date. He's certainly had some life experiences these last few uh, days. Yeah, that's true. Honestly, you could oh, make money off I of surviving the important. Cyclops killer. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. My part in the Cyclops, new something Cyclops important. killings. Like, you I could do that. I'd do in it. There. Hell yeah. I'd exploit my own trauma for that. <laughs> Iris is awake. R really? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Look at him light up. Damn. <laughs> yeah. She's due to be Why are you showing her with both eyes? Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> God. You saved her life, you know. Maybe. She can get a prosthetic. Maybe. It's fine. Yeah. Huh? Maybe what? <laughs> Nothing. See that's you, a kid. bat. Don't give him a hero complex. Don't do that. Bye. Is Iris your girlfriend? Yeah, no. I'll introduce no. you next time. Ota, don't lie. She's a great girl. Oh my, I'm looking forward to it. Is she going to be your financier? Oh, maybe I should clean up a bit first. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> financier? Oh, fiance. Oh, oh yes, wow, yes, we're really getting ahead of ourselves. <laughs> Jeez, Mom. <laughs> I hope you never breed. <laughs> I mean, you gotta love that awkward laughing. We just need Titus. I made the laughter real. Yeah. 
Oh, hi. If only you had that already saved. I should have that as a sound clip, yeah. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you didn't solve anything. <laughs> ah, looks like another all-nighter. Good job, team. You were going to mention the Titus laugh too, Natch, right? Sweet. <laughs> it's just a classic laugh. <laughs> we wrapped this up a lot quicker than I was expecting, by the way. Really? That was it? Impressive. I expected it to be just that. Oh, I knew it was just that he was going to drag it out longer. Aww. I thought we were just going to have to pause at certain points. Nah, we're good. That was a cute little ending. I like it. This has been your yeah. favorite as well, May. It was a sweet little ending. I agree. It's really cute. It's the fact that you saw So's dead body. I mean, that also was very... <laughs> didn't look into it. This is like, oh, yeah, that guy died. Oh, fuck him. I'm done with my investigation. <laughs> oh, not your favorite? Okay, I gotcha, gotcha. Oh, you like the post-ending info. Oh. What's the post-ending info? Are we going to have like, a little see. scene? Oh, okay. Yeah, we've okay. gotten a scene for every small ending. I see. Hmm. Is she going to be your then, financier? We all need financiers, yeah. Do you want to be our financier? What, me? What am I financing? Yeah. No, I, Finance I do. my cat's uh, post-secondary education. <laughs> your cat's education? Very tempting. Yeah. yeah. They, they like need it. They really do. Yeah. I like to see, like, a... Uh, a layout of uh, how my investment's gonna pay off for me. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll get on that. I'll ask <laughs> Iba to do it. Be sure to add lots of graphics. Makes it easier than just having to read. Get you a 5090 when it comes out? I can get you a 5090 nanotrites. You can pay me for it, though. But if you... Uh, you if gotta you... pay. I mean, I can get them physically. So I usually have pretty good luck getting them physically. Hopefully they're not hard to get. I don't know. We'll see. You redeem it with your pledge? Wait, what was your pledge? I forget. What was this pledge that you made? You pledged your soul to me. Perhaps it's the fact that he's still paying you. You know? Oh, for your membership, you mean? I see. Oh, I didn't know they're... I mm -hmm. guess you can refer to them as pledges, yeah. Oh, I see. Yes. I'm pretty sure they're called <laughs> pledges, yeah. Are they called pledges? Are you? I think on YouTube they're called memberships. They can call them pledges too. That sounds very cultish. Official? <laughs> oh. I'm going to pledge uh, my allegiance to try in mourning. We yes. we have talked about starting a cult several times. Yes. Technically, there has been a cult before. On the server, yeah. That's fun. Yeah, the, I forget, we had a cult ranking for something. I forget what it's for. I would love to start a cult, personally. Yeah. Or just, like, be in a cult, I guess. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm gonna overtake you on this, uh, in this game, huh? Is that right, May? Maybe. Moving I don't know. We got another, like, ending, I believe. two or three hours we're playing this for, yeah. So it's possible we might overtake you. <laughs> You're under the cult of Try and Morning? Well, welcome to the group. There will be uh, badges handed out eventually, maybe. What are the member rankings? Who's the right hand of the cult? Is it do like... I, do I actually have... Hold, hold on, let me see. I mean, I don't know if we still have it. I for, I'm trying to remember like, where it originated from. It's from like a certain game. Oh, wait, we have the scene. Oh. Well, I, Here we I are, post-credits. I'm delaying this as long as possible. That's fine. <laughs> Take your time. Yeah. I think it may have been from Persona. Oh, was that it the makes cult sense. of? Oh, I think it was from Junez. It was either Junez mm, or Junez Teddy. Cult. Yeah, that's what it originated from. I miss when we could gamble on your server. They could bring mm. back the gambling. I you do guys enjoy really playing it. blackjack. <laughs> no, I think we just have cult member. Yeah, we're just like one. We didn't have tears. I mean, I probably should have made tears. 
Could have made money off of that's, that. That's usually how cults work, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. I'll have to work on my cult raising abilities. Okay. Uh, you could play Cult of Lamb. You could play that. Would you guys like to play Cult of Lamb at some point? Is that just it's a single a player game? What's that like? If you literally play a lamb and it's a dungeon crawler and you build a cult. Oh, I'm glad you like the face cam, eh? Yeah, it kind of was like an accident. I had it for the Thanksgiving stream? I had a, th a stream on Thanksgiving? I did? What did I do for Thanksgiving? I can't remember now. You crave gambling? Oh, we could sate more people's addiction then. And then I'll have to open up the casino again. I'll just have to do it. What games have we been playing recently? Um, let's see. Well, I've been playing this, this obviously. <laughs> um, I've been playing... Well, Yakuza. Mostly just the stuff on mm -hmm. stream. I'm planning to get back in Elden Ring again. Because that's we there's a the DLC coming out for that. Games. What are we doing? Yeah, we actually got together for the tabletop yesterday. We did uh, Cards Against Humanity. It was very and, fun. And War. <laughs> Yeah, because it's a fun game, yeah. It's a great game. Honestly. We've been doing a lot of cabaret management in that game lately. Yes. Oh, you know, I think that was like two Thanksgivings ago, technically, Nanotrites. Yeah? Yeah, 2022. That's right. Yeah, I, I was away for uh, last Thanksgiving. I was in, uh, I was at a casino. <laughs> Bring it back to the casino. Oh, we, don't have a, we don't have a schedule for tabletop yet. It's just whenever we have time. Yeah, yeah, there was just a bunch of people together yesterday, so then we just happened to do it. Yeah. But, Recently yeah. on my own with, like, family, I've been playing a lot of Phasmophobia and then Genshin and Honkai, which are just dailies. Aw, yeah, you guys... Well, actually, I've never really known people who have played, like, those gotchas, except for you and Nanotrites now. So I'm kind of, yeah. like, learning about that from plays. you guys. Uh, and oh, Shadow Cat also plays. Oh, interesting. Please what? Uh, Genshin and Honkai. Oh yeah, yeah. I didn't Shadow Cat, it. you, no. Nano, me. <laughs> I don't think you should play it. Try. I'm not no, playing. it's no. it's a lot, uh, but it's fun. I enjoy it. Um, I don't play it for the gotcha aspect. To be fair. Mm hmm. And then I s started playing Unpacking. Oh, I saw that. Yeah, interesting game. It's mm -hmm. quite cute. Yeah, I like games where I can decorate spaces. Yeah. That had a cute little story to it as well. I really liked seeing that. Yeah. All right. So we're going to get some little uh, information here. Let's see. Has there been any progress in this Jima investigation? None. Zero clue. Not exactly. We have two. Oh, well, he died. Sucks for him. Two? Yeah, it was Two dismembered. Of information. <laughs> yeah. But they may not connect directly to the murders. What are the two clues? Point one. This may be easier to see than explain. Oh? I sent a video to the boss's PC. Could you check there, please? Okay. We'll find something else on our PC. What's this? It's from Sunday night. Alright, I always remember whenever I see like a chair in the game, I need to get a new chair. My chair's a piece of shit. Yes. After Date <laughs> was beaten by Ota at Matsushita Diner. Yeah. That's uh that's fair. So embarrassing. Tessa, wait. Uh, I'll get the car. <laughs> Oh. There, stop it. I love the scene actually. I this earlier as well. Do you see the walk on the floor beside Iris and Mayumi? Yeah, what about it? Look closely. Yeah, the I'm walking on it. It's curved. Do you notice anything in the reflection? Iris and Mayumi. Enhance? Yes. Yeah, we need that enhance uh I have prepared an CSI. enlarged and processed version of the image. Okay. Boss, the next video. 
Oh, yeah. I, I remember what this is. You I completely mm -hmm. forgot that this was a thing. Enhance! You, you stay away from my boy! Tessa! What's wrong? Did something happen? Just disarmed her. No, everything's fine. Okay, let's go. She had the knife. Yeah. Ota. What the hell? Yeah. Mm -hmm. She takes the the knife. Hey, what's this? Okay, I'm trying to, on this route. What ended up happening with the knife? I know that Oto was stabbed. He was stabbed. Yeah, Oto was stabbed. Okay. I guess you know she probably wasn't really prepared to like fight. Like she was just confronting Maybe. her and wasn't actually expecting like a confrontation. Yeah, Arisa she was sort of just tonight. holding it. Yeah. Uh, Mayumi just continues, but this should be she enough. always holds on to that knife when we first yeah. met her she was just carrying it with her even though she was friendly and Tate had to ask can you put that knife down <laughs> but I also it would be quite kind of intimidating if someone completely blankly reacts to you holding a knife at them and then approaches you to grab it mm -hmm. what if Ota's testimony like, is true it's a strange situation that if you're not ready for it it does kind of leave you speechless yeah that was that was interesting maybe it was taken off of iris when she was kidnapped at the femisto parking lot whatever we can think about it later i mean yeah it's a possibility she could have just had it removed from her whenever she was kidnapped but also real weird that she took the knife yes that was very weird. Especially because, you know, she can't give a testimony currently. It doesn't seem very... Tessa Timoni. Tessa, as we know her? Jesus. Like, there's obviously more to her. <laughs> the way she reacted like that is like a professional. It's like Agent 47 <laughs> shit. It's not, weird. it's not the first time she's done something suspicious. Remember when we interrogated her in one route? Uh, when we found Brenju's dead body. Ota, save me! Yeah, she was being sneaky then, too. I mean, that I would kind of expect from her. Because it's kind of like, you know... Well, she's being deceptive, obviously. But it was like kind of like... I wouldn't be surprised about her being deceptive. Like, that move was like, ooh. I mean, she did kind of get raised by a... Uh, you know, what's his name? 86? Oh, not quite. They weren't that together like for that long. It was a couple of months. Maximum six months. That's yeah. Hmm. She was but... already a, a child yeah. in, like, probably elementary. Hmm. I don't know, then. You said you had two clues. Maybe she watches a lot of, like, self-defense videos. What's the other? On YouTube. What's the other <laughs> clue? Try get to the other clue. Okay. I know. We're yeah, trying. What's the other one? Or I'm trying. I have learned new information. You are try. He is try. More thorough autopsy <laughs> results of Renju's body have revealed something. An object right. in his intestines. The best An part. Object. A clump of organic Willow, I hope you're here. Has he been eating people too? Because it was partially digested, it took significant time to analyze. Well, what was it? Well, what was it? Shoko Nadami's eyeball. Oh, hey. A little bit more eyeball soup. We had eyeball soup. Those eyeballs. Yeah. <laughs> not nom nom. Um, not nom good. nom. I didn't see that one coming. You never saw it coming. Mm. <laughs> it is the eyeballs. my soup. favorite part. Of all I really, of the routes. I really like it too. So just acknowledge. We still have eyeballs missing. 
who a has those victims. other eyeballs in their intestines? That's the question. Anju couldn't have eaten all those eyeballs. You know, he's only got Shokos. We have to do a thorough search of everyone's intestines. It's the only way we could solve this now. Anyways, I don't think Annihilation's gonna open up yet. Oh, yeah, it's not open yet, so... Yeah, you have to start on the true one. Do you think you can get Troy through Iris's first Somnium on that side? Yeah, I think I can do that. Okay, that I'm gonna we're doing clean here? something quickly. Yep. Yeah, that's your only option now. All right, then let's go down this rabbit hole. <laughs> that was some pretty interesting info that they threw at us, yes. I, I'm not sure how to digest that yet. What is this place? Apparently he wasn't done digesting either. Hmm. It is uh, difficult to move like this. Why do you look like that? You get a little bit more detail here. There we go. I went with a simpler look today. I figured this world couldn't handle my full resolution. Guess that's fine then. That is. We true. do get a lot of iris somniums. It's because she's actively connected to the main person that dies each route. Mm -hmm. The like, first iris somnium we had was very room. different, though. That was in that like weird room, wasn't it? What was that room? Mm. Uh, it's the abandoned warehouse. That was the that abandoned you then warehouse. Go to in her, uh, yeah, in her somnium. We, yeah, we didn't go back there. Yeah. That's where her first sink takes place. You can quit if you want, you know. Hmm. And it's significantly darker as well because you're going through. That was very murders. dark. Yeah. Never, I will never give up. You don't have to take it that far. In any case, it seems that we've finally arrived. Is this world made of jelly cubes? This is Shovel Forge. Shovel Forge. I don't see any shovels or forges. Iris said that she was focused on streaming this. It's kind of like two different personalities, because like once her streaming personality, and then the other was like her like. I guess is more of her real persona. What's that got to do with forges? Yeah, one is a set, and then there's Iris. Yeah. Forget about the forges and listen. This Somnium. You can kind of tell of when she's forge. talking to um, like Ota as well that sometimes her voice goes up in pitch. On a map. I'm not playing this game. On the contrary, you already are. Oh, come on. I don't want to play. Accept the reality, Date. You have no choice. Good evening, good morning, and hello. It's Tessa, also known as Aset. You bet. I'm going to be playing <laughs> Shovel Forge today. Yeah, I'll be, right obviously very clear this is Aset Iris's mode. Let's play has begun. Yeah. I, this is a good I tell you to see it. You have to help me. It's nice, they're coming. Like, just Find the me, difference Dante. in her tone of voice. Oh, a pickaxe. Lucky. What was that all about? It appears that this Somnium will not be easy like the other ones. I didn't think the other ones were all that easy. This is stream reception. I guess it is. Are you ready? Let us begin. Streaming the Let's Play. Now... Was it right in the beginning Sorry, that we had to avoid activate. doing something? No, we've got some time. Okay. So let's follow what we're being told for now. I'm Mental. sure you'll remember where the break happens. Yeah, there's like one point where like we were told to do something, we had to do like the opposite of whatever it was. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, we followed the rules first. Now we're going to break them. Mm-hmm. Now we're going to break all the rules. Oh, hello. Feels very personal. Wonder if Ota is friends with A Set or Iris. Um, he's friends with both. He's a fan of A Set, but he's Iris does talk to him as herself. This doesn't like look notably like Iris that, does see him as a friend. That's what Iris identified it as. Yeah, if he could be like a bit more normal, I feel like they'd probably have an even stronger friendship. <laughs> but he probably, like probably yeah kind of has trouble with that. If they're wasn't a, a parasocial relationship pickaxe. there. Mm -hmm. But the fact is, is he idolizes her as a set. Yeah. Kind of ironic, this what stops him from getting like an actual relationship with her, probably. Not necessarily like a dating yeah. relationship, but like more of a. This is 
sworn her friendship. Actually, kind of fun. Yeah. Or, but maybe she could Standard open up to him a little more if he yeah. wasn't constantly focused on her being an idol. Absolutely. That pickaxe was dropped by someone being attacked by Nice. Be careful, Date. Nice might be after <laughs> you too. <laughs> oh. That's one way to put it. Nano tried. Do you mean that in every way that I'm thinking you're meaning that? Did you get that? <laughs> I'll be no. being attacked. <laughs> I will All judge you, you do so much for that one. She says. But which Iris? There appears to be two. I guess both for now. I mean, that's the way that I saw that immediately. That could just be on me, though. I think we'll find something if we dig <laughs> there. Let's check it out. I think it would be funny if I was being the, like, innocent, naive one something. for once. Oh, now, Trush, are you serious? Oh, I... You're fucking with me. <laughs> Everything looks like a block. No, 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 come on, explain it. It's he he came for A set, stayed for Iris. Self-explanatory. Said what you said? Motherfucker. <laughs> Alright, just don't be too hasty. Anyway, it's time for you to dig. And remember that it's a QTE where you have to spam the button. Yeah. What do we have back here? Iris's live stream is showing on the monitor. I don't want to listen. Just move on. A door or gate? It is closed. It um it helps in Iris's case, I guess, that she, while having been an idol, is still very big on wanting to make friends. Yeah. And so a part she of her like is she needed just that. a tad trusting to people. Like, she's definitely closer like to Ota say, than she would be, say, Moma. But she's closer yeah. to Mizuki than she is to Ota. Go, Iba. All right, here I go. She's a bit gullible, probably because of just the way she grew up. I got a rare material! Ooh, I knew today would be special! This is kind of fun, isn't it? And then Iba? kind of yeah. being, you know, left by... What she at least has a father figure at one point. Are we meant to do this the whole For a short period of time. Yeah, her this kind of tiring. She called him uncle. The gate's mm -hmm. open. Let's go. Um Roger. But also, yeah, her mom very much raised her in the like, just be happy and exist for you, not for others. This do what makes area. you happy. And we cannot return to the previous one. Yeah, the whole conspiracy thing, like, I didn't see that coming, exactly. That just sort of developed very quickly. Well, when you consider that she wanted to be an internet figure, those are things that you just tend to bump into, and if something caught her eye, she just sort of went with it. Mm-hmm. Oh, is this the crafting table? That this is where we do something, right? You can create items here. The terminally online. <laughs> we need the correct materials to craft something. What can we make right Gotta. now? Good job. Got it. Oh, hi. the vending machine first, buddy. Oh, I was gonna hand myself. No. Yeah. Oh my god, they punished me with a times around. four. Jeez, game. Must be a <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. All right. Happy digging. Hopefully it'll be fine. Roger. Too much Reddit. <laughs> That's the worst. I got a lot of materials that time. Good haul today. Be sure to like and subscribe and to read to it, everyone. That's right. Be sure to like and subscribe, everyone hey, listening to this. And yes. now you get to do the thing. <laughs> golden yoga show? You know what's funny? Like, YouTube never really mentioned they do this, but if you say subscribe in a video, it actually highlights the subscribe Indeed. button. Like, it lights up it, a little color. Yeah, it makes it rainbow. Yeah. But it probably is based wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I'm bringing up the stream now. Can I you say don't... it again? Well, J Pedal, make sure you like and subscribe to try morning. Please. Look, Dante! I don't know if it does it during a stream. It does it during videos, at least. 
Yeah, no, it didn't do anything. It probably has to like have processed the subtitles. I think that's how they probably tell. Uh -oh. Fine. That would be my guess anyway. Okay. I've got the we At least how they do it on a technical level. Might even ask Try if you feel any distinction between you and Try and Mornin. That's a good question. Oh my gosh, we're um, <laughs> assuming I'm not subscribed to Try. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Aww. I wonder if that's like. Nice maybe that's an me. impact on it too. I mean, that's a good question. Is there a distinction? Somewhat, yeah. You have I don't know. I probably don't have very much of a strong separation between the two. Maybe it's more of an exaggeration between myself and what I play online. Probably things like turned up a bit. But no, I don't have like a complete separate persona from how I am in real life. At least particularly not lately, I guess. Maybe earlier on. But now I'm just kind of, I guess, chilling just doing what I would normally do. But what are we supposed to do? I, I think I'm pretty the same. Yeah. I just behave. <laughs> you behave sometimes. Yeah, I I just <laughs> like will not say things that are clearly just like not to be discussed in a public setting. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, I mean that's that's just normal. We all have like our own social airs where we talk about certain things and not others. Yes, I do just exist. We just exist here. Yeah. I do idle things and it's pretty much just me being like... Actually, no, that, that makes me different. Like, hello, my name is yeah. Crystal. And, yeah, you do idle um, things. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you have I a different chose self a very situations. specific song to dance to because it's kind of from a children's magical girl show. That was just a weird thing that ended up awkward as I was uh, doing the emceeing for part of the show. Someone else's solo went bad in our last live performance. Aww. And so... Like he he was going to mainly MC it, and he was like, "You have to MC for like, for now. Just like I can't do anything right now." Oh, is that the word for it? Nano tried code switching. Yeah, that's probably what I'm thinking of then. Yeah, like in different social situations, like the way you act around, like say your parents or whatever, then the way you act around friends or that kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. That I get. Mm -hmm. It's when I'm streaming, like it's probably a bit more like that maybe. than actually having a different persona, I would say. Yeah. How authentic do you be online without it being jeopardizing your own privacy? I mean, I guess it depends on, like, what you consider private. Because I think everyone has their own kind of, like, standard of that, I suppose. Right. There's the obvious for, of, like, for... not giving out your actual name or the best option, of course, never give out where you live. Yeah. I I think even with my idol persona for myself, I am being the most authentic I can be. Mm -hmm. While also being like, I'm not going to publicly air any bad experiences in the idol community because that just causes issues. And on one hand, it does look bad on you, but also, like, I don't want that to be out there where everyone thinks the idol community is bad. Because also, apparently, the idol community in Toronto is known, like, worldwide oh, now for being really bad. <laughs> yeah. But, like, because, like, apparently, the other like u.s idol communities are laughing at us for having so much drama yeah yeah but I... my group is the only one that doesn't really do drama and that's because we've just been in this for like some of us seven eight years mm -hmm. it's hard to say may like what i would tell you is that it would be very dependent on like how well you feel you know that person because um yeah you can get really close with people you like meet and talk to online 
and um <laughs> try you know I, I shut up um uh <laughs> but the point is it's it can you can have healthy relationships with people online it's just it can be difficult knowing exactly where to i mean it depends on the kind of re relationship you want because i mean I would say from my experience as someone who is both paranoid and grew up in a household where like you were told not to share things online, having internet friends can be very tricky. Mm -hmm. um, and I'd say if you want to start with your name, don't go with your full name. Tell them your first name first. See if they're comfortable sharing their name. Um, figure out boundaries. You don't want to just exposit information yeah. to people you consider friends without them being comfortable in the same I way i like the way nano trites uh kind of yourself. puts it it's it's like a two-way street like if the other person is kind of like giving and receiving to then like yeah it just kind of like flows naturally and i think it just feels right i suppose um but it is also important yeah. to acknowledge that sometimes you or they might not be comfortable with what is being shared and you should mention it then and there yeah you gotta so be like, honest with each other about small. things you know about like how you're like, feeling yeah like me and onyx uh, i am the oversharer and onyx is the undersharer yeah you shared so much immediately and it was very overwhelming and i did not tell you my name for like a solid year yeah yeah, I understand that. I mean, like, like, I didn't. You got a fear of being like, you my name on like purpose. That. Like, most people aren't going to do that kind of thing to you if, like, there's someone that, like, you've developed a relationship with. You shouldn't be telling it to people, like, as soon as you meet them, though, probably. That wouldn't be my recommendation. Yeah. Like, if you're questioning, Definitely like, oh, should I share that. this with someone? Then most of the times the answer is no. Um, I don't know. You just always stop to kind of, like, ask yourself, like, just how well do you know this person, how comfortable you are with them? And, um,. Yeah, I mean, if you ever want advice on this kind of thing, um, yeah, like, ask us on here or, or on Discord if you want to talk about that kind of thing. Like, yeah, obviously, honestly. J Pedal, Onyx, I have a lot of experience with this kind of thing. You can feel free to send a, a private message yeah, if you feel want free to just to talk us. about, like, hey, yeah. what do you think is okay? Yeah, these definitely are a specific example. As online friends. Mm -hmm. I'm probably the most suitable just because of my, like, I, I do the idle things. I overshare, the idle but thing. also <laughs> I I have somewhat of a presence. Like, oh, I, yeah. I barely have any social media presence, but I do have a, a social media somewhat persona just for the idle stuff. Mm -hmm. So I think that's She's kind of more what you're for going friends. for. Oh, okay. Yeah, she specifically mentioned her friends online. Like what is okay mm -hmm. to share and when. Um, gotta agree with Nano though, undersharing because it's not pleasant for people to know. Yeah, I get it. Mm hmm Yeah, like I have a mix of it people just... on like Discord that I've been very close with and other people who I just kind of talk mostly about the streaming with and you know, just been Yeah, he's not very close circles. to us, clearly. No, I'm close to you guys. At least I like to think so. <laughs> no, the, what you're seeing right now is all a complete lie. Guys. We're not friends. We're associates. We're business yes. associates. <laughs> well, we're, we're associates with Try. Onyx and I are still dating, so we are more than associates. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Sometimes I do sound like I treat you like an associate. I come well, off Well, that's as... on you. If you interpret yeah. it well, that way, then you can yeah. decide when you want to change that. We are so I'm not either. going to poke poke you about it. Uh oh. I'm just trying yeah, to be a nice around. girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have like a more of a public persona, then yeah, that should be something you keep more boundaries with. And then I guess every now and then, yeah, you know, sometimes you do have particular people you share more stuff with and it's less of a barrier, but you always got to keep, like, the original barrier up, I guess, with, like, just the general persona. Yeah, okay, I think like, it's always good to just start small. 
And if it's someone you've been close to for years and for some reason you're not telling them things, and if you try and write it out and it's just like, man, I don't know if I really want to send this, just like, don't that probably send means it. You if they're yeah. asking about something, just say, um, I'm not in the right headspace to explain this right now, or I, I, I don't uh, know how to talk to you about it now. <laughs> because I've had that a lot with my best friend. And I know the things that, that are causing it. Because it's like just everyday life things. Mm -hmm. Which make me not want to share info. And also like her past relationship things that make me more um uh, guarded about relationship. Like my own relationship info going to her. Mm -hmm. It's like, it's just stuff to get over. And you don't always have to have the most, like, built up reason why. Yeah. Just, just be like, hey, I, I don't think I can do this right now. If it goes on for years like it did for me, you are going to have to get to a point where you just give them info in a satisfactory way for them, though. If they're, like, a really good friend. If it's, like, putting a strain on the relationship that you're not communicating enough. And it doesn't feel like you trust them enough. Hmm. It's weird. It's dumb. Hey, Iris. <laughs> go, uh, suck these balls. Damn. Wow. It's got some strong <laughs> feelings towards that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I would say that um, if you're feeling guilt because of, like, the other person that you're, like, you're not sharing stuff, that's probably not a good sign. If you're just feeling, like, guilt within yourself, like, oh, I feel like I should be sharing more than I am, then, like, I, w I would just, like, try to feel, like, tell myself, well, if I'm feeling this, I am feeling this for a reason that, like... I am not able to share this and it's not like I'm being a bad friend like if they're not even requesting in the first place then I wouldn't be worried about it that would be my take anyway I think you're yeah I think you're going through like the university years revelations of like you get just far enough into adulthood where you start to feel friendships that you've had for a while change just a little bit and everything's shifting in mm -hmm. front of you and then the you have to like reevaluate how you see everything and how you talk to everyone. I this is what it comes off as. I I do think everyone does have to go through that. Mhm. Mm dance. Yeah. Ah. Dance. <laughs> <laughs> just dance. Don't worry about it, just dance your problems away. Use the most beautiful art form humanity has ever created. The power I don't know, I want the money and power. Money and power is always nice. Yeah. That's what you're not making. And if nothing else, just feel like you should do the things that are right for you and not necessarily what's right for someone else. Just focus on that first. What do you think, Iba? And then Once more, other things I develop naturally. Nano what now turns you now? Um, I don't think there should be a required amount yeah. of things you share with a person. Especially yeah, if absolutely. They don't make you comfortable. That's the the what thing about. I mentioned was only that it was a hindrance to not my relationship with exist. my best friend, and it was just like me being too nervous because of like me. honestly trauma to share that information and that really wasn't hmm. that big of a thing in okay. the first place. We have to decide our next move. For now, we need to find somewhere to craft the discipline. I like, you, don't you like sharing too much. Gotta, and so I'm a big fan of that overall, what you gotta do is trust yourself first. And, uh... Yeah. yeah. You gotta figure like, out if your discomfort is irrational you. or not. Because irrational things you can push through and tell people anyways. It seems you can create items but if it's rational, then obviously just it's not going to be now. good whether That's you the tell them or not. Expected. You're not gonna be happy with that. 
for me it was irrational blocking me from telling, so I could push through it. Weren't we supposed to craft a disco ball? Yeah, that was the other route. Yeah, but it was bugging me. Uh, it's something you have to develop on your own, getting that <laughs> ability to like figure people out and what you could trust them with. I mean, you shouldn't just like blindly trust anyone. But I feel eventually some, you build sometimes up to, like, like I blindly trust. But uh -oh. what were you no, saying? No, I have that. I feel sometimes like I blindly trust, considering the amount uh -huh. of people I trust. Yeah. But really, there's a level of things to how deep I go with, um, like my personal history. Usually, the thing that gets people and they think, "Oh, this is a sign of big trust," is me talking about how much my grandfather's on my father's side death um affected me mm -hmm. like this is a thing that comes up very fast in me meeting new people but it's actually just like a surface level thing because it's it's so important to my personality that it's out there all the time and then it can get deeper and deeper and deeper um so i guess just because some of my really easy to get surface level information is so <laughs> it, it feels more personal than it really is to me mm -hmm. uh, uh i can see their reaction to that and whether they're comfortable you know i i don't know how i do it though honestly i just i just vibe i get that could be very tough if like I don't know if that has happened to you before or not, where, like, if you've trusted someone and then they kind of betrayed that trust in some way. Yeah, that could be very... It could be very difficult to move on from that. If that has happened to you. Also, I don't think blindly trusting is super bad either, because as long as you're not giving out personal information that can be used to locate you... Yeah. You can block people online and just not have to hear from them again. Mm hmm. You've got trust issues now, Trites? I'm sorry. Mm. I, it's, wow, I couldn't tell. <laughs> yeah. You knew that from like before? I could tell from the way really... he was typing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I guess there, maybe I don't have as much experience with that. I guess. I I guess I'm the most naturally intuitive person here in regards Possibly. to feelings. You've had people make second yeah, accounts contact you. Yeah, that's Ooh. that could mm, that would definitely mess with you. I see. It's good to acknowledge that not everyone will be like that and sometimes it is just about overcoming a certain fear you might have. Yeah. And, you know, taking bad experiences and learning from them, you know? Were there red flags? Were there signs that maybe this person wasn't as trustable? Then kind of build on that. That's how I figure out if I can trust people or not. Oh, God, really? Oh, oh. damn, me. <laughs> Wait, no, I hate that. Oh. Yeah, that's a common thing on the internet. That's why I will just not post too many photos of myself without covering at least part of my face. Yeah, oh man, I'm sorry to hear that. People are... They're all sorts out there, aren't they? Yeah. They still your personality and your way of typing. Oh my goodness. Ooh. You know, I don't... I don't think I have a personality people would want to steal. <laughs> like, I don't have a bad personality. I'm just very plain. I'm, I'm very docile um, in my social media presence. When I'm speaking, I come off different. But typing... docile. Oh my god, someone contacted you about it, that? <laughs> oh no! Yeah. Yeah. The internet can be a tough place to, like, navigate and actually handle things like that. Yeah, that's awkward. Man. Yeah, I could see why, the, you know, you have these questions then. If you had someone do this to you. 
No, I would say then you just I have mean, to. Like, I mean, you definitely have like cause to be could, cautious and suspicious of that sort of thing. But if like there's people you're talking to and like you really get to know them, and I don't know what kind of level you're talking to them on, because like a lot of people I end up like kind of like talking to and trusting more, like that I've met online, have been you know people on Discord I've actually spoken to in person, have like streamed with, and that sort of thing. And that's kind of like, oh, you know, we know each other on a different kind of level. And that kind of like establishes trust. That's why, I, that's what I meant when I meant about you, like not blindly trusting in people. It's like, it kind of like builds up. It's not like, oh, I just met you and now, hey, we're, uh, we're besties. I'm going to tell you absolutely everything about me. Yeah. That sort of thing. Trust you know time. Mike on another level? Who? What? Mike Money Mike. Gamer. Do oh, you Mike, know Money? Mike Money Gamer. On it? Yeah, because like I've. Like, he told me all about his, like, personal life and so many things about him. Things that still other dog. people aren't supposed to know. Yeah. And it's like, yeah, because, like, we started talking and... <laughs> <it's> just... <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, what happened? Did I miss something? But he just said who? <laughs> to Mike? <laughs> no, I didn't hear... <laughs> Alright, that is really funny. But no, I genuinely didn't hear what J-Pedal said. I was, like, thinking to myself. Mike who? Who is Mike? I don't know this man. Yeah. But no, I yeah, like feel we so were, bad for Mike. We were like doing like little uh collaborations together on YouTube and then it just kinda like flew flowed uh, naturally. That, you know, oh, like this about him, that about him, this about me. Like sharing like that kind of details. And uh yeah, then we were like calling all the time and doing like even more let's plays together and that sort of thing. The mic is in front of my face. I, I know. It's now. in front of my face. Mic now. It's ah. touching your nose. I can touch my nose with it, yeah. Anyway, um, yeah. But I guess I kind of naturally am willing to trust people and like kind of see where things go. I don't know. If you really trust me, give me ten dollars. I can't give you $10. I keep you trying to extort him. Why do you need money so badly, j Petal? I just... I'm not getting a lot of shifts at work, okay? Oh, I see. Okay. j is always asking for money. Worse than me. Yeah. You second that? <laughs> what, you second wanting $10? I don't think you do much good. You don't use dollars. <laughs> it's worth more here. It's worth more in Canada. Yeah. Yeah. It's more dollars in Canada. Oh, you're right. Technically, I have sent you money, actually. That's true. <laughs> you did. And yeah, then, that's like, true. You gave us yeah. games in return. Yeah. Yeah. Much appreciated. Yeah. Well, you guys are all welcome, of course. One moment. Done. If I feel you send awkward. me money, I can get a game. What game do you want to get? Does this crafting table um, even do anything, really? I feel the like there's is one out that I ought to get. What switch? I don't know why, but I feel weird. It's like, oh, you guys are thanking me for something. I don't know. I'm just like, oh, it's like nothing. Like, <laughs> I, I never just, thanked you. I just, I just like doing these things. Just watch. I think I. What are you doing? I think I thanked you when you first I invited me on the stream. I think you did. Yeah. Just, oh, thank you for letting me <laughs> You're help you entertain <laughs> mindless people on YouTube. Yeah. You know what? Thank you guys for being here, by the way. Date, don't listen thank to you her. for doing this. Right, it is weird. So, this is what Nice <laughs> looks like. Nice, try. Thank you, J-Pedal. <laughs> this is what's behind all this. Oh, Nano oh, saying thanks you're... for existing. <laughs> now, try thank you for existing too. <laughs> I want to tell you, and you. Yeah. I actually mean this sincerely, and like this isn't me trying to be silly or whatever. I'm glad you exist now, Trites. And I'm glad you're a part of these streams and that stuff. I, was I will fully me? agree with that. I really enjoy talking with you. Mm -hmm. You're a really cool dude. I'm also, yeah, good lying. night, uh, May Bruma. Oh, May, thank you for coming by. Have a good night. And, Hopefully uh, our, our little chat with you helped. Yeah, if you have any other questions, you know, we're all in that Discord together. And uh we'll get through this all all together. That was okay. Oh. You. <laughs> you can't let it fool you. You have to use the power of dance. Just 
just keep dancing through life. You have That's to right. use the power of dance. Look at that! The enemies disappeared. Oh yeah, I hope you enjoy uh your playthrough of AI as well. Hopefully, you're eventually able to finish that. <laughs> I know you're probably busy with the uni life. Wow, more blocks. Aw, oh, good night. Is this a glitch? Sleeping noises. This is pretty glitched. It's pretty cursed. I'm not lying! Please believe me, Dante! Yeah. I'm not yeah, the hate to mutual. Aw. Well, now we're in new territory. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say, what did you? Iris is you made the other thing, the correct? Monitor. We did make. You don't the other have thing. to I do anything with the monitors. I don't know. I was just seeing if there's anything interesting I can get from these. So one third. Mm. Probably not worth it. This appears to be another gate, but something is blocking it. I believe I we see. continue on like normal up until the pedestal. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, that makes things simple. There's also another, uh, potential encounter with this guy. Uh, why? Okay. Why? 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 Why, why? 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 why am I doing I this? Oh, <laughs> iron. Let's move on. This is a spacious area. Is that marble? Oh. Those flowers are winter irises. They're wilted. Mm -hmm. Wow, this place is huge. How are we gonna check uh -huh. everything? Maybe so now we're gonna do something completely different. Materials I have. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Another crafting table. At least you don't have to do any more digging. Dante, do you see that shrine? This guy should be achievement related. Shrine. That's humanity's yes. last hope against nice. Save us from the oppression of technology. Return the stone monument to the pedestal at the shrine. We should have all the materials we need to What's the name the of that guy? Monument. The Unabomber, whatever it was. Please, no. Dante. You're the only one who can save me. <laughs> that is, that the, is the wrong thing. This world. Well, he was like anti-technology, that's what I'm thinking of. Yeah. Dante. I'm the only one who can save her. Hey, Dante. Right. Where did you get that from? Wait, what? What's wrong? It's just where did where did you get that from? I don't know, was he like a guy who like lived in a cabin out in the middle of nowhere and like all anti technology? That's what I'm thinking of. We have to save the world from a, the oppression of technology. What? Yeah, yeah. It, but it, it wasn't the Unabomber. Who was it? My friend Maddie. I'm not, it, I, I feel like I know what you're talking about, but, but the Unabomber was a completely, like, different case. He didn't live in the cabin in the woods, but he was not anti-technology. Okay. Well, you're the expert on this stuff. You should tell me. You know all about this crime. I... <laughs> you're letting me down. <laughs> I, I don't... <laughs> okay, I don't I appreciate that. What? <laughs> you know about all these killers and... People. I don't know about all of them, but the Unabomber was a terrorist, my dude. Yeah, he, he was bombs. a terrorist. That was the idea. Whoever it was, I'm trying to think but of who it was. Anti-technology. Someone was. I'm, I'm gonna look this up now. Do you know how many terrorists there? My media. I know there's a lot of terrorists. The... What are you talking about? Baller bomber. But I don't oh, think oh, so oh. either. All right, the Unabomber yep. was Ted Kaczynski. He had a mailing bomb campaign against people he believed to be advancing modern technology and the destruction of the natural environment. Oh, that, okay. That, that Unabomber. Unabomber. Yeah. That Unabomber. <laughs> it's important to tell me names. Uh, he's known as the Unabomber. It says it right there. <laughs> yeah, but there were more than one, like, historically speaking. Mm. There have been a couple of terrorists that are just called that. He is the Unabomber, though. When you say Unabomber, you think of Ted. <laughs> well, I'm glad we got this cleared up now. Very important for uh, the plot of AI. It's dangerous to do what Iris tells us. Yeah, super so important. Look, bombs are the best name. part of technology, and apparently, the only uh, 
Yeah, salvation of technology is the fact that you can make bombs. No, At only salivation. Salivation. Well, he is saliv like, salivating with his bombs, yeah. You can make bombs with those. pretty dangerous. simple tech. Mm-hmm. You don't need national. it to be overly advanced, yeah. I guess. It's a very reasonable use of technology, I believe. Look, the big power move is just calling criminals by their first I name and I only their first name. You listen to Iris here. There's a crafting table here as well. Okay. So, Let's... What are we crafting here? I know that we're looking. I don't think we're crafting anything yet. Oh, okay. I don't remember if it's for the achievement or not, but we're looking for something labeled question mark. This appears oh, we're looking possible. for something first? Oh, death. That could just be the achievement. I don't remember fully. Oh, there it's on that side. The, yeah, in the, Marble's building, I believe. Yeah, in Marble. The achievements in right Marble. There. What do we have Talk here? to him. Huh? Oh, no timey. All you right. have no time. Oh. Oh, I can do this. Who is this? Futoshi? That is not Mama. Futoshi. Can I talk to him? <laughs> well said, now tries for any intents and purposes and watch this in the future. This is all being discussed in Minecraft, the video game. This is a yes, legal disclaimer. I heard that Futoshi left on a journey to Sri Lanka to cultivate tea leaves. I heard about this as what? well. Really, Futoshi? You're just gonna leave Ikuno behind? Terrible. Someone's there? Apparently. And now you only spend, spend 40 seconds you? doing a task. Yeah, a little bit less. Hi? What the? They're a zombie. Oh, this is Minecraft. No, it's Shovel <laughs> Forge. Yeah. Copyright. A sword would have been more effective, but okay. That scared me. Why is there a monster in marble? Hey, You'd be surprised. Oh. Please. Is that We're just so mean to Mama. This man? Oh, not again. What? You know him? Not exactly. He is a familiar face that has appeared in many unrelated people's dreams. He is I've an heard. urban legend of sorts. If you are interested, I can tell you more later. No, that's okay. we got more important things to take care of here. Oh, well, you know, have you seen this man? You're a material? Many, many times. <laughs> now you can go to the crafting table. All right. Crafting table B, actually. A crafting table. The FBI now has a protocol that says people making threats in Minecraft. I wouldn't be surprised. That doesn't surprise me at all. And we're going to be crafting an A. Crafting A. All right. What is an A? Oh, I get it. You can take advantage of this glitch, Date. We glitched the game. I don't know anything I about guitars. I sincerely hope we have enough time in I the sink. Glitch. I feel like we You're still have rich. things to do. <laughs> I could do that? We'll see. This game is filled with bugs and programming errors. Wow, they're really taking shots at my... I mean, uh, Shovel Forge. We can take advantage of that to reveal things not supposed to be seen. I see. This Let's game's try. basically a glitchy mess. Understood. The hell are programmers even doing? Would you like this in your inventory? What? It spent the this man material. I guess. Sure. Why not have this in an inventory? Is it a glitched skill? Oh, I see. How about that? Anything change? The numbers have changed. What? Is it August thirty second? No. The pickaxe is level two hundred fifty five. Oh hell yeah! That's pretty extreme. But with this glitched item, we may be able to destroy something we were not supposed to be able to. That is just like, I wish something my pickaxe was that level. Or rather, something Iris doesn't want us to destroy. Oh. There's a wall. This is a strange yeah. wall. We can break it now. Dig. I see. Dig through the wall. I just need to use the pickaxe. You're right. Do it. Leave it to me. 
Now it tries. By the way, I made a tactical decision to not say that word on the stream. I feel like that would get me in trouble somehow. Wow, this is really taking a lot of force. There we go. The wall disappeared. He busted through. The iris has bloomed. No, this is no miracle. This is a hell. Merely the result of the game's programming changing the iris from wilted to bloom. That can't be. Dante, what are you doing? Surely underestimating the power of programming there, Dante. What about the monument? Yeah. What about fighting knives? Tell her that we have the strongest pickaxe. We don't need that. My pickaxe is too strong for Let's you. Continue. Just moving on. It's too high level. Dante! No! Don't abandon me! Aww. Abandon her. That's sad. Damn, is that lava? That's why you don't dig down. Can Underneath us the entire time. The screen? Is it loading? Well, if you need to use the bathroom, now's the time. Okay. Try just abandons us midstream. <laughs> yeah, he he would do that. It's fine. We'll make entertaining conversation. Hmm. Cannibalism. Okay, so I just have to pick up some milk. Bread right making. Back. Oh. Yokocho, not the world of Shovel Forge. I'm disappointed. This might be Iris's real Somnium. Oh. There's nothing here. We have no choice but to move forward. Oh, this place is big. You know what else is big? That pickaxe? Dante's pickaxe. Uh, we just have a yeah, gate on the other side. The Run! Um, Don't let anything get in your way. Run, 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 Watergate! Expecting someone to come out and hit us, but no. Looks like we're good. Oh, there's pyramids this at the end. ends with your death. Don't worry about it. Is this the exit? <laughs> mm -hmm. Great. Just go. What else are we going to do here? I can't wait to Invincible Rainbow Arrow yet again. Oh. We're back. Hey, look. Mm. What? A pyramid? Nice is close. They're Dante, back. Help me. Please. They're never far Iris. away. Let's help Iris. Let's help her by freeing her from her world of delusion. Reveal the truth. Mm, that's different. Imagination, Date. This is new. Mm -hmm. No, you're try. I knew. <laughs> Can we destroy the pyramid? I don't think you do anything here. Actually. Oh, we don't. Mm -hmm. oh, we could get a timey from one of these. I'm pretty sure I know what to do, and it's not this. Uh, no, I believe we're looking for a mirror to destroy. Like, yeah. Last time we mm. went to the mirror and we danced. Mirror door. Now we're gonna go to the mirror and, uh... A mirror like door. But do the opposite I'm of dance. Reflected in it. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? Destroy! It's yeah. a p Here. Climb this first just for fun. Can we be rational and look at my feet? <laughs> Why did we have to mention that? Your feet look like a sad, sliced open hair tail. Do oh. you think I can climb it? It's worth a try. Then I will try. You can have blocky feet. Oh, I'm I'm trying actually. Sorry, I, I can help myself there. <laughs> you see, like a, you look pretty. Like a one and a half like block. Aww. Sorry, I'll get serious. Please do. Oh. A mirror door. There we go. Well said, Date. No, you can't. That mirror amplifies the power of dance. I'm sorry, then Iris. I will do it. We just have to do Stop, it. Stop, please. Ah! Gotta Damn. dance. Can't dance your way through this one. 
Did you, you recognize can't leave your that? Behind. No, I don't recognize anything. Is this from Singing in the Rain? Was a child? Aww. Oh. Oh, hi. Iris, this is all You're very embedded. realistic looking. You're imagining it. It's not real. No, you're wrong, Dante. Iba. Nice wants to kill me. Let's end this. Yeah. Let's end this. It's trying to present the case. Put all the pieces together. Prove that she's wrong. Oh. Hello, Iris's core. Well, I guess we're destroying the core. Believe me. That's a, that's a good reference. Iba, that thing there. Uh. Destroy it. Damn. Cool. Break it. No. Understood. Please stop. <laughs> the sounds are so cute. The little footsteps. It's like wearing the the Mew mm -hmm. shoes. A little bit. Yeah. It is the fact that, um, you know, imagine getting your essentially heart destroyed by just a, a little pixelated character. That's the worst. Bing, 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 bing. Now we're back home. Oh, little kitty. Where's your hot mama? Wow. One track mine on you. <laughs> And there she is, reading conspiracy magazines. As a 12-year-old. You do. There he goes all yeah. the time. Now what have we done? Oh. Enough. Back to the diner? Okay, I think I got it. So it's like this. Date and Tessa were attacked at Golden Yokocho by a group of unknown gunmen? No, not unknown. Uh-oh. They were hired by Nyes at Laws, also known as Nyes. Just a shortening of their name. Yeah. Secret, and now they want me dead. Date, is this for real? Not really. It's true that we were shot at by armed gunmen. But the nice part. The sink earlier. It didn't prove Iris's story. It only made me more skeptical. Iris is lying, maybe even unknowingly. She believes that she's being targeted by Nyes. She sincerely does, but. Believe me? I thought about it carefully before answering. Just let me be honest. I think you're letting your imagination get the better of you. It's not my imagination. Why don't you believe me? Date, you're just believe being stubborn. Believe me. You're, you're just a cynical old man who doesn't believe in anything. Then you have Aww. to give me He believes in love. Do you believe in love after love? Then you have to give well, me the- he's in love? <laughs> he's in love with your mom. We just- We just want the other- Earlier version. If you can't Previous proof, generation. I can't believe you. <laughs> Iris, seriously, you're imagining things. Sorry. Fine, Sorry, Iris, we just don't believe you. You're stupid to think I could trust you, Date. Bye. Oh. Oh, shit. It's getting up. Iris stood up and walked away. Wow. You stayed with me, huh? 
I'm surprised. Yeah, we have to pay I live her here. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you would have gone chasing after her, though. I mean, come on. The way he is. Alright, whatever. Stop checking all this extra stuff. Where'd Iris go? Huh? There's a room back there she kind of made her own. She's oh. probably there. Oh, she ran out the front door. She certainly made herself at home. Has Iris been back there before? Good question. Yeah, Tess has been here a few times. Okay. I was about just to make a joke about that. I wish you'd stare at me. Do you believe any of this? Date, you don't believe Tessa, right? What part of that gave that away? Right. <laughs> you don't believe Nizet Laws exists? No, I don't. Then why was she almost kidnapped? I don't know. But it might have something to do with Renju. Hmm. He was looking for Iris. In any case, we don't know who's behind it. But we know she's in danger. Which is why I came here. I need you to hide Iris. What? I need to go somewhere. To Hitomi's residence. Yeah, I need to talk to her immediately. You're a prom? Yeah. If you make her mad, you make me mad. All right, Mr. Tough Guy. Well, I guess you'll have to be mad then. Yeah. <laughs> guess you're just at the pout. She had to hear the truth. The cold, hard truth. Even if that's true, you could have worded it nicer. You could have handled this better, Date. I think so as well. You are as clumsy as ever. <sighs> no support. Hide Iris? Yeah. I mean, I don't mind, but... Oh, of course you don't mind. Why here? The organization that I'm in may have a traitor. Ah, right. So I can't take her to HQ. That, of course, means that I can't take her to my house either. So I thought this diner would be a good place. Her enemies wouldn't look for her here. If she's here with you guys, I know that she's safe. <laughs> he liked that too much. I don't like that. Wait, you guys? Yeah, I'm expecting one more. Any huh? minute now. Oh. I mean, someone there has she to is. Have to be protecting. Oh, Don't worry. Sh I understand everything. <laughs> I'll protect Iris. I trust her. Anyway. Mm -hmm. I mean, you've seen her take out here. an Everyone's army of people, out, essentially. Right? Right. Oh, he is so disappointed I know how now. <laughs> Good luck, you two. Thanks, Date. Oh, thank you, Mizuki. That's oh, hello. I'm sorry for coming so late. I need to talk to you about Iris. What is it? I steeled myself and Iris continued. said something to me that was very concerning. She said she's being targeted by an organization called Nizet Laws and that she needs help. Yeah, have you heard of this Does before? Does this sound familiar? I decided not to tell her about the shooting at Golden Yoko Show. I didn't want Probably her to Probably a good worry. idea. After a while, Hitomi spoke. I didn't intend to hide it from you. I just never found the right time. Uh oh. Huh? She's sick. Iris has a malignant brain tumor. Oh. How do you feel about that? That escalated quickly. Brain tumor. Well, do you remember what happened last route? There was something short circuiting with her brain, according to Iva. Ah, that's what that meant. Yeah. Ah. It makes her say strange things sometimes. You can play that in either order, by the way. You could get this information before seeing that. Mm -hmm. Her delirium could be a result of a brain tumor. It can also cause hallucinations and violent thoughts. 
It makes sense. Everything Iris said was likely a result of her condition. Damn. Which could also explain some of the other things she's done. Which they're gonna flash back on a few things, I think. Words malignant brain tumor circled my mind. So I relieve dark very freaking quickly. Maybe check out the the foot cabinet just in case. I was worried talking about these right here. <laughs> oh um, no, you can't even turn around. They won't it's let me not turn any more than this. Okay. We can't focus on feet right now. Sorry, JP. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait. A refrigerator? Oh. No, we're too yeah, serious. No jokes this time. There's no There's not about this. Things. Yeah. I just drew it when she was twelve. It means good news and hope. Well that sounds a bit different now. Does she know? I wonder. She doesn't act like it. I didn't tell her the specifics, but Oh wow. I'm sure she knows. Hmm. How long has she been sick for? We found out in January. She suddenly collapsed at school. She went to the hospital and they examined her. They found a tumor. According to the doctor, surgery wouldn't help. You mean Grade four. Terminal. She has a year to live. At most. That's what the doctor told me. And if they were right, then she only has a few months left. Because sometime real soon? Oh, that's right. I forgot she said that. I'm going to die. How could you forget, Try? It's a brain tumor. It can cause a number of side effects. Nausea and dizziness. There's so many signs. Aha, it was warning sickness. Sometimes her hands and legs go numb. Mm. Eating Ota's terrible, terrible omelet rice. <laughs> she can't I, mean, I, I guess to if you're gonna die soon, does it matter? At least enjoy no. better food while you're alive. I'm kind of warm. What? That was all caused by her brain tumor. It's a kitchen counter. Any way to save her? Ordinary treatments won't work, but there is one way to save her life. Which is? Interrupted. Date, it's from Mizuki. Uh oh. <sighs> Why now? Sorry, could you excuse me? Are we already getting problems here? He's trying to forget. I was not trying to forget. <laughs> he is trying. But I'm not trying to forget. Date, I'm, I'm sorry. I... What? What happened? Iris, she... she Got died. away. I, she disappeared. I only took my eyes off her for a second. What? Where did she go? Ota's that useless. Well, we knew that part, at least. But she left a note on the mm -hmm. table. Ota sent you a picture. Did you get it? I have it no. now. No. Oh. I don't have a phone, Mizuki. <laughs> I'm going with the person I trust most. Please don't worry about me, Iris. Sorry, you did forget. <laughs> Damn it, nanotrites. <laughs> uh, the person I trust most. So who would she How trust the be? most? Hmm. Who's an important <laughs> team player that we know about? I have tried calling Iris with a different line. 
I cannot connect. It is probable that she turned her phone off. Damn. Mizuki, let's split up and find her. Let Oto know too. Got it. Did something happen? She was eavesdropping. Well, it was hard not to hear. We're in her house. <laughs> it was about her daughter. Uh, I told her that Iris is missing. What? Yeah, kind of let her get away. Too many went quiet. She didn't ask why she disappeared. I'm sure she thinks it's the tumor. She thinks that Iris's illness is making her go insane. Iris said that she was going with somebody. With the person she trusts most. Any idea who that might be? No. Okay. I'm gonna go look for her. I'll go too. No, please, stay here. She might come home. But... Mm. It's alright. I'll find her. Trust me. Trust me, I haven't fucked this up yet. Okay. Totally. Got the soul under control have to here. Wait for a, m a moment where you can say, try me. Don't try me, AJ Penal. <laughs> you always do it Dante. anyway. <laughs> wow. Who do you think that is? Who does Iris trust the most? Iba. The flying grandma. The center console. I think we're in serious oh, wait. mode. Hold on. Where's the uh rear view mirror? I can see the scenery. Oh. Okay, yeah, there's, there's nothing. Special. Me? She just told us how much she hates us now. Yeah. She kind of broke that thrust. I'm trying to remember now. Because we jump. Renji's still alive? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Just checking. <laughs> I'm like, I think he is. I think so too. Uh, you literally got a flashback at the start of this saying that Renji was looking for her. Said? Right, right. to him he's done so much for me i know i can rely on him more than anyone else especially you now data according to the mermaid at sunfish pocket he was looking for iris mm -hmm. i think renju called iris and iris went looking for him exactly Mr. Eyeball and Intestines. Do? We've been looking for Renju. Everyone at HQ is looking for him too. Not to mention he's on the run with number 89. And even with all of that, we haven't found him. We don't even have any leads. Where could he be? If we only had some clues to work with. Then mm -hmm. we wouldn't be in this mess. Are you giving up? Yeah. It's calling it quits here. Alright guys. See you for uh, another game. Sorry, I don't know what to do. Iris Rude. might be with number eighty-nine at this very moment. We need to find her immediately. Now think, Date. Where would Renju go? Where would he go? Fishing. Wait, into the glove box? Is he in here? No. Lend this gate. His house. Sunfish pocket. Sunfish pocket. Let's ask about sunfish pocket, of course. Ota already searched sunfish <laughs> pocket. It's open for business. However, Iris was not there. I mm. didn't ask about Renju, but I am sure that he would have told us. Well, I guess it's not sunfish pocket. <laughs> Where would he? I, have we even seen his house? I'm trying to think. No, you oh, haven't. You, you can ask about it. Well, well I guess we'll ask about it. Sure. house is currently occupied by officers from HQ. If he went back there, we would have been contacted. Mm hmm. The cold storage warehouse. 
We always go back, don't we? Mm -hmm. I got a call from Mizuki. She went to Lemnis Gate, but no one was there. It's true that they've known each other for some time, but when we went to the house, he was not there. Oh, I forgot I was just there. Sorry. The cold storage warehouse. The cold storage warehouse. Maybe he's there. Well, it's the coolest place to hang on town. Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> Feel ashamed. I'm sorry. Well, you're not. No, I'm not really that sorry. Why don't you just draw up in the water? <laughs> like Iba did. <laughs> Wouldn't that be oh, cool that to just hang out some fish spice? Should be a barrel of fun. There's no one here. Damn. He's not here. Let's go, Iba. All right. We failed. What's oh. wrong? Is there someone here? No living organisms detected. What about dead organisms? No living organisms detected. Damn it, Iba. Let's search the area. We might be able to find something. Well, we do commonly find corpses here. Oh no, it's in the box. What's in the What's box? In the box? Yeah. Oh. Her dead body was right here on the workbench. Well, not this time. Oh, there's the forklift. The forklift. Doesn't it seem off somehow? It hasn't been in use for some time, but something is peculiar about it. Uh uh. Oh, I managed to look in the box then. It's too forky. It's empty. Lots of boxes. Well, this is a warehouse. Can't believe they'd put all these boxes in here. Hmm? What was that? Something in the shadows. Oh, the ice cream machine. It's way back there. Hasn't been brought out yet. I wish there were dragons. I could imagine them. No. This can't be. Guys, I found the failed most again. giant ice cube Iris. for the world's biggest cocktail. Oh. Iris. We're not very good at this. You're not very good at it. No, try. There's <laughs> a, a weird corpse, though. Oh, yeah. sucks. We don't need more ice picks. The eye's already gone. Well, here we go again. I'm not carving into it, I swear. Okay, but like, someone could just Have you settled down? kick him Push us. right now. That would be very cool. Being inspected without you. It would be so easy. This time the body didn't disappear. However, you lost consciousness. I am not going to sit on the edge of any docks with you guys around. I feel like one of you would kick You're me off. You're too edgy. Based I, I wouldn't push you. Out. No, I didn't say push, I said kick. <laughs> I wouldn't kick you either. Course, to be fair. Mm, okay. I did not predict you to be the phantom type. Ooh. Nice I would you. I suppose humans are unpredictable. Now that you're back. What was the observation? Uh, the white eye was missing. Yeah. You are conscious, are you not? Are you at a it's loss? It's pretty important, I'd think. 
Date, don't let negative thoughts consume you. Just shrug it off. It's Iris fine. died because of me. If I never took her to Ota's, this wouldn't have happened. If you truly believe that, then your brain is completely rotten. Or perhaps when you saw the corpse, your head became filled with images of blooming yellow dandelions. Excuse me? What? <laughs> oh, you're talking now. Was I correct? If you consider the situation logically, even an elementary school student would understand. Huh? Fine. Allow me to pluck some of those dandelions from your mind. I will ask three questions. Please answer honestly. Oh. First question. Worried we get questions like the this. The storage warehouse was not in regular operation. But even so, the AC was on and a minus 58 degree temperature was maintained. It's a bit chilly. Why is that? I'll ask your question in a second. Hold on. There, there's nothing really to look at. There's a lovely red barrier. <laughs> Where are you? You're invisible. Oh, I know. Oh, she's just in your eye this time. <laughs> she's always just in your eye. For ice cream, of course. Yeah, for ice cream. Oh, I see you are back to making jokes. I am Maybe. glad to hear that, but please stay focused. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I guess maybe they're trying to preserve the body? To preserve okay. something. Well, that is typically yes. why you keep things so Let cold. Let's move on to the next question. Second question. There was something strange about the corpse. Do you remember what that was? Yeah, there's a corpse. She was dead. Oh, uh, yeah, we have the eye. Those are strange things. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, nothing really funny to do here, I guess. That is a unique factor. But there was something else. Something more peculiar. Oh, really? What did you find more peculiar about it? Hmm, wait. It was completely frozen. She wasn't missing for very long. Not even a full hour from what we can tell. Yeah. Iris's body was completely frozen. The temperature read negative 58. With Iris's weight. Just wondering, but how much do you weigh? <laughs> Don't you know it's rude to ask a lady that? 105 pounds. I see. 105, huh? It should have taken about 18 hours to freeze solid, but we were... <laughs> Does he have the calculations for that just in his head? That is kind of creepy. <laughs> question. question three. Two days ago, Sunday night, you found a dead body in the cold storage warehouse. But afterward... You visited the Sagan household and discovered that Iris was in fact still alive. Why? There's an imposter? Thus. Are we doing Danganronpa again? Single rhombus. <laughs> uh, I will neither confirm nor deny this. We actually did see a body. I see. I understand now. Maybe we're thinking about this all wrong. Iris isn't alive. She's dead. I saw the ghost of Iris. Oh, that's not what I want to say, Date. <laughs> Mr. Date, it's time for medication. <laughs> the 
So they killed her and they had someone impersonate her. Is that the current theory? Well, either someone killed the real Iris before and there was someone to cover for her, or Iris was the mastermind all along and she faked her death, which would be very dang romp you. <laughs> It's all very Danganronpa if you look at yeah. it in that light. Yeah. 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 Who's locked? Whatever. She would have live seen her own death, but it could have been a fake death the first time. The, the one that will progress things is Yamin because it's yeah. something that's not written out there, obviously. So, like, pick all yeah, the other ones expand. first. Also, mm -hmm. the live stream because death didn't happen her. this timeline. Yeah. But what, is, what I'm starting to wonder is that live stream death in the other one. Hey. I wonder if that wasn't really Iris. Was she like, is she like faking her own death in that other one? Wouldn't that be something? Date, think logically. What the fuck is she doing this all for exactly? What occurs in dreams does not affect reality. <laughs> and parallel worlds... Okay, well, this, this has gotten interesting because now I have, like, an actual working theory. That is even yeah. less... Parallel like, worlds do exist. Right. I love getting to see your your mm -hmm. brain actually doing things. So that's... I know, I, like, I've never I seen haven't your brain work so before. Long. I'm sorry, it's, like, coming together now, yeah. Something's coming together. What I, saw in I don't want to know that something's coming. <laughs> Hush. It was a dream. No, Date. You're overthinking it. You saw the corpse. But Iris was alive. Which means... You mean... You've got it. <laughs> How did you know? I bolted in the road like I shot a oh. gun. At the kind of like cut points uh, that we got going to Tuesday, mm -hmm. just before this, that would have been a locked thing if we didn't do every single other thing we could do till now. Oh, all right. So yeah. we preemptively like unlocked something so that we wouldn't uh, have to come back to this route again. Ooh, very good. So we will have to come back to it later. It, it is yeah, going to we'll lock get eventually. Locked off again. is completely frozen. Getting a more thorough look would require removing the cloth. However, we would not want to be disrespectful. You can use a certain vision mode instead. Mm, of course. I don't believe it. The stomach is swollen slightly. She appears to have been pregnant. Well, the morning sickness. How? Do not worry. The uterus does not contain a fetus. You mean after she was killed? No. The fetus was not present in her body when she was killed. She must have been killed after giving birth. Like recently after giving birth. Not immediately shrink after birth. The expanded uterus takes some time to return to its normal size. This evidence makes one thing perfectly obvious. This corpse isn't Iris. Who is this? It's someone else. That's the question. Which means... It's Iris too! Iris is still alive. Not necessarily. She could be alive. We haven't confirmed that yet. <sighs> Multiple stab wounds with a single edged, sharp object to the victim's back. Judging by the size and shape of the marks, the weapon was most likely a kitchen knife. Uh oh. Mm. Everyone's first murder of choice weapon. That damn kitchen knife. This matches what you said on Sunday. So this first is the body I saw. weapon of choice for their first no weapon of choice for everyone's first murder. Mm. 
Why was it's it so hard? Go. Is there an yeah. estimated time of death? Impossible to determine. This body has been completely frozen. completely frozen for at least ten years. Oh, <laughs> that's a reaction. That's so good. Oh. Ten years? She was killed more than ten years ago? It wasn't six years? Exactly. <laughs> her identity is unknown. Her killer is, but there is no, one there are, suspect. There are a couple of important things that have been mentioned in that timeline, though. Who? Let's consider the clues. In that time frame. The scene. Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. Sunday night. We saw So here. And there is something else about So Sejima. We witnessed someone similar to Iris being stabbed repeatedly in So Somnia. This is like some minority report shit right here. But it wasn't Iris. It was this woman. That is highly likely. What we saw so this was seems... So's memory from more than 10 years ago. So saw fake Iris get stabbed 10 years ago. Or the original Iris. Ranju and so. Oh my gosh, Iris is just Ramada now. But we still oh god, what an awful Renju. reference to make. <laughs> mm. That means that we need to talk to. So Sejima. Yeah, we looked at her face. Iba, who is this? Unknown. Jane Doe. Pitiful corpse. Just looking at her makes my chest hurt. Hmm. I think for me it's the way that she's curled up. Specifically. That makes yeah. it so kind of sad. It does. Well, back to the Sejima residence yet again. Always leads back here. This asshole. So, you've got some explaining to do. Mizuki and Oda keep searching for Iris. But unfortunately, they didn't turn up anything. Arch's whereabouts are still unknown. I'm worried about her, but without any leads, we'd just be looking for her blindly. We should focus on the investigation for now. It will eventually lead me to Iris, I'm sure of it. With that in mind, I head to So's mansion. I hey, buddy. I never to show your face here again. Are you feeding your fishies? A pond. Are you feeding the kappa? Are you feeding the merman? I don't see Maybe him. Maybe it's a mix of all three. Did you check the little island? The island had nothing. Okay. Mm -hmm. What did I keep well, seeing? Oh, we're once more in a serious part of the story, so. Yeah, this has been very serious. To oh, there we go. Wow, enlightening. You had to check your balls. <laughs> Always. Well, hey, buddy. How are the Koi today? I didn't come here for Shoko today. I didn't come. I'm here not for playing myself. Koi. <laughs> Getting straight to the point. Instead, I'm here for a girl who looks like Iris. Did you kill her? Date, look. How many people have you killed? I knew oh, it. Oh yes, the merman in the bathtub. How could we forget? Mm. You that killed her, didn't you? you? I don't know what you're talking about. I bet it's probably, but he's probably walking TV, you know? You wanted to check on the body of the girl you killed. That's why you were at the cold storage warehouse two days ago. He's still feeling his coin. Where is Renju Okiura? You know where he is, don't you? You were at an Okiura fishery warehouse for a reason. There's definitely a connection between you two. And that's not all. Number 89 called your secretary. The same mm -mm. number 89 that Renju escaped with. Look at him smile. Now tell me, where is yeah. Renju? He looks so Suddenly, happy. A gang of bodyguards stormed out of the mansion. In an instant, they surrounded me. He pressed his Aww. panic button. He has a button for when he's fallen and can't get up. We'd like to ask you to please leave. 
Who said that? Which one of you? <laughs> wow. They were very polite. And we actually just listen. I guess we're not going to yeah. argue with all those guys. At least not Too this many of them. Damn it, so. There's nothing we can do. We did arrive without a warrant. We were technically trespassing. <sighs> pesky warrants. If Always getting in the way. Police, we would be in a predicament. We would have been detained immediately. Who would look after Iris then? Do you intend to leave your responsibility with Mizuki and Ota? Yeah, they've been doing a pretty good job Mizuki, so far. maybe. Calm down, Date. We still have our lead. Lead? Before I explain, we need to discuss the corpse in the cold storage warehouse. All right. Let's get back to the name. corpse. Because she is frozen solid, we could call her All Ice or Alice. What do you think? All Ice. Alice and Iris. I believe it fits nicely. All right, mm -hmm. Alice. What about her? Someone might be able to identify her. Who? Allow me to ask you three questions. Again with this? First yeah. question. You have seen this corpse more than twice. Three times, in fact. When was the first time? First time. Oh, Tri's really gonna have to think. Yeah. Do Guys, you remember? try and make him remember. I want to see if he can find it. Steering wheel. She's in my car. <laughs> you just <laughs> took the body with you? Yeah, she's in my glove box. Oh, I think I remember what happened what day. Yeah. Oh. Is there like a... Tell us. Do I have a journal? How does this work? Uh... Unknown. Is it in the time chart? The flow chart? Well, the time will tell you... Yeah, the flow chart will tell you what days are what. Uh, alright. Well, like, we're you'll here. see little images. Okay. Day five. So you're currently on day five. So, well, I guess that was the night we found the body, right? Because this is the f the sink with us. That's the sink where we saved Iris or Alice, I guess. But is that the first time we saw the body? No, not necessarily. But that's when we found that body, at least. Now. What happened before that? Well, this is the very first one. We dropped her off. But I could tell you to go back and replay something to try and get more hints. No, I can say that he can just guess it. Yeah. Not like there's a penalty if he gets it wrong. But this was a fairly important thing. Yeah. What's case balls? Oh, it gives a description. All right, so let's explain when we found the frozen corpse of Iris. It was in this one on Sunday. This is when we went to the park. Yeah, 
acá. I don't remember seeing a body that day, though. Did we? Did, did you read that whole thing? I think so. Hold on. The thing that you were reading. Did you? Then. Can you just read from the top, please? Like, out loud? <laughs> oh, in Mizuki Sam, Date discovered Iris's corpse in the Somnium. Right. Oh. But was it Iris's corpse? You're or right. Or was it just... Yeah. Okay. Interesting. She had seen that. <laughs> you stared at that so intently, and I was like, oh, he's done it. He figured it out. Wait, I'm gonna look at that again. I was like, whoa, that's really direct. And then you just leave the page without <laughs> saying anything. Mizuki's son. You need a you brief need on what happened. Yeah, what happened at Sonia? Like, um, I kind of remember. The carousel goes up into the air, and underneath of it is a curled up frozen body with pink hair and stab marks. It's the corpse that you just saw. Yeah. Okay. And he thinks, obviously, it looks like Iris. So then he contacts her to make sure she's alive. Right. Hmm. Three days ago, Saturday night when I synced at Abyss. Yes, in the song. Yeah, this just, I gotta agree, this, Mano. I thought he had put the whole thing together. <laughs> yeah, this just goes to show that he actually wouldn't have been able to do it alone. <laughs> Question two. Who is the girl? All ice. Yep. Yeah, we know that. What are our options here? Asia. A virus? Adrian? Wait, say Adrian. Who is Adrian? Adrian? Adrian! No, of course not. Oh. Damn it. It's a reference to something. Yeah, I've heard that before. Right? What is that from? I don't know. <laughs> I, think, I think I heard Metal Gear, but I don't know for sure. It's almost Metal Gear, like the way she screamed it. Yeah. Almost. Sean! Well, this isn't heavy rain. Who is the girl? I have no idea who this girl is. A virus? What does that mean, a virus? A virus? She was way <laughs> too big to be a virus. Take this seriously, Date. Nah. Well, it's Iris. So with the eye thing, it sounds like it's obviously related to like the last serial killer, but that was those other serial killings. They were six years ago, right? That's when all that stuff was supposed to have happened. The main serial killings, yes. The main serial killings. Mm -hmm. So this is almost like a test run of that that happened ten years ago. Well, I said at least ten. I was gonna years, say right? it is. It is pretty important to acknowledge that most serial killers will have test runs, like yeah. test victims, to figure out their style. Mm hmm So it could still be the same person. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, I but I don't like, know the What I like, what I want to keep. Her eye is missing. And it's her right eye, which was mm -hmm. the killing six years ago. Yeah. Adrian! Oh, also, you know, <laughs> oh, Rocky, we know that there right. were more than one. What was that? Sorry. There's more than one? Oh, you've already been told that there were more than one involved there. Right, yeah. So there's no saying it wasn't just the second half. 
Okay. What am I saying here? Alistair Iris? I mean, we're calling her Alice, but that's just like a name we made up. Say Iris because it's wrong. Okay. Huh? Are you serious? How did you come to that conclusion? Well, she could have been Iris too. We even really want Iris. Now I know. Character of Iris could have been based off. That girl was probably Alice. Most likely, yes. So we have technically known Alice for three days. Mm. One last thing. The final Getting question. to know a dead body. In which Somnium did we see Alice? Oh, well, this is the one we've just gone over. Adrian! 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 Rocky! <laughs> Oh, there we go. There you go. <laughs> Rocky! <laughs> what the hell? But seriously, I am talking about the course. Do you think you should be joking at a time like this? Apparently. You're the one who joined in. My roommate. Mizuki Okiura. My roommate. My roommate. Exactly. Not that child I'm caring for, you it's know, the best way that putting I'm it. the guardian of. Are nonsense. Nonsense. Dreams are not made of the future. They are made from the past. Therefore. Mizuki has seen Alice before. There is no Mizuki ran into a dead body. Iba, where is Mizuki now? It happens. Where we went with Iris yesterday. Mm. Okay, happens quite often, apparently. That means the first day of the case. Was her second time seeing a dead body. Unknown. Dead she murdered body. For Iris. Okay, let's go. Ooh, the shrine. Date. Hey. Did you find Iris? If I did, I would have told you already. Of course you would have. Right. Our favorite place. Nothing new here, though. Chozuya? You wash your hands and face here. I guess we really are in serious mode from this point on. Yeah. Oh wait, what about the monument? We usually... Wow, nothing even for the monument. Okay, Mizuki. Where's Ota? I think he's searching Akihabara right now. Oh, of course. He's at the maid cafe. You got distracted easily. Like he does. Iris is with Renju. With Daddy? Yeah. Her note mentioned her most trusted person. That's probably Renju. Yeah. I remember that mermaid girl saying something like that. He was looking for Iris. Does that mean that Daddy is the one who called for Iris? It could be. So I need to know where he is. But I haven't been able to get a hold of him. No. Iris used to like this shrine. She told me about all her memories here. We used to come here all the time. You know those steps in the front? We would sit there together and talk about things. Like what gluten-free means and <laughs> eyelash extensions and aerial yoga. And mm. we would talk about you know, all, all the important things. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes we would talk late into the night. So I thought that maybe she'd be here. But it looks like I was wrong. Mizuki, I have something very important to ask you. I told Mizuki about the frozen corpse we called Alice. You've seen her before, haven't you? Three days ago, I saw her in your Somnium. The body of a girl who looks like Iris, Alice. Your dreams are built from your memories. But how long ago it was? So that corpse... 
Mizuki, please answer me. Iris's life is at stake. Huh? What do you mean? Like, if this was 10 years ago, she would have been... But she's 12? She would have been 2. Yeah. No, 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 no. Like, the body you're was assuming... Murdered. Oh, she might have seen the, the body The discovery of the body point, was fairly I mean. recently. Yeah. Ah. Because she saw the frozen body. Okay. Not a fresh corpse. I told Mizuki everything. But how Renji ran off with the assassin, number 89. Not a comforting thing to tell someone. No, don't worry, he's a very comforting father-like figure, so it's all good. Apparently. So is Sejima as well. Yeah. I wouldn't want him as a father. And that Sejima's linked to Alice's murder. I need Great. to know everything about Alice. If I find out who she is... I might be able to solve the mystery. Keep saying the same Alice. I don't know who that is. And that might lead me to Iris. Mizuki looked down at her feet quietly. I could see the agony in her face. The silence lingered. Finally, she steeled herself, lifted her head, and spoke. Okay, I'll tell you about Alice. All right, let's get into it. I saw my daddy crying in the president's office at Lemnus Gate. I was peeking through a crack in the door so he didn't see me. Daddy got up, then got into his car and drove away. Uh -oh. I had never seen him like that before. I was curious, so I followed him in a taxi. That led me to the cold storage warehouse. He got out of his car and went inside. I followed right behind him, quietly. Daddy was standing next to the forklift in the back. I hid behind a shelf. I watched Daddy open the hood of the forklift, and then, after a little bit, he left. I wanted to know what he was looking at. I went over to the forklift, and I looked under the hood myself. And then... You saw Alice's dead body. But at the time, I thought it was Iris. Mm -hmm. For good reason. What do you mean? I couldn't just ask. It would have changed everything. I thought that as long as I stayed quiet, everything would be okay. I didn't see a dead body. I wasn't even at the warehouse. I repeated that to myself over and over and tried to forget the whole thing. Repressed memories are often the subject of somnia. That's why Alice showed up during the sink. corpse looked exactly like Iris. I couldn't believe she was dead. I just couldn't. So I went to Iris's house. Huh? What's wrong, Mizuki? Iris was alive. I thought I was going crazy or dreaming. I tried to convince myself that it was just a hallucination. What was I supposed to do? Daddy would have been in trouble. So you kept quiet this whole time? Yeah. I actually met with one of the higher-ups at Daddy's company last night. Before I went to Matsushita Diner. Why? Because you asked about the cold storage. I was curious. I asked around some, and... I found out that Daddy was managing the warehouse before I was born. After my grandpa died, Daddy took over. In exchange for managing the warehouse, he gave ownership of the company to someone else. I guess he didn't want to let this place go. Or maybe, maybe because there was a corpse there. That's yeah. Accurate. Yeah. I think he needed that. But I understand why. Inside that warehouse was. Alice. On paper, Daddy has nothing to do with Okiura Fishery. 
Daddy was still managing the warehouse. And he was the only one allowed in there, too. That was part of the agreement when he gave up the company. And the whole thing had to be a secret. He really stressed that point. Hey, Mizuki. How long was he managing the warehouse? For 18 years. That's what the man told me. 18 years? From that long ago? Yes. Iba, I need an emergency search. Missing persons from 18 years ago. Uh-oh. Understood. Huh? Mm. Date, I found her. The girl who looks like Iris. What's her name? Who could it be? Monica EY, 19 years old at the time of her disappearance. A graduate of a Toku high school. What? Renju was my classmate at Eitoku High. We've known each other for 20 years now. When I was young, I... I lost someone very important to me. Monica Iwai, my best friend. One of the only friends I had. Alice's... Monica. Hitomi's friend who went to the same school as her and Renju. But why? Monica's body was found just now. But even back then, Hitomi knew. She knew that Monica was already dead. Aiba, where is Hitomi right now? At headquarters for questioning. MP oh. still believes that the body they discovered was Iris. Okay. Got it. Contact boss. Have them bring Hitomi to Abyss. Roger that. Wow. That was a lot of information we got there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we're getting right into this. Okay. Yeah. Questioning time. You're awfully calm. You saw the corpse of your daughter today. You were called into the station to confirm her identity. And yet here you are, cool as a cucumber, even though you lost your precious daughter. Shall I guess why? He's cute as a cucumber. Oh. Her name is EY Monica. She has been missing for 18 years. She was 19 years old at the time she went missing. Monica Hitomi Sagan and Renju Okiara all attended a Toku High School. Monica's body was found completely frozen solid. Her right eye was missing. Obstacle. Shows multiple stab wounds from an edge weapon to the back of the torso. The cause of death was those stab wounds. The murder weapon was most likely a kitchen knife. She was Always also kitchen pregnant knives. until just before her time of death. Monica's corpse was hidden under the hood of a forklift in Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. This warehouse has been under Renju's management for 18 years. Mizuki witnessed Renju checking on the corpse. This of course means that Renju knew about Monica. Because Monica's corpse is completely frozen, it is difficult to determine her time of death. However, her appearance appears to be unchanged from when she went missing 18 years ago. Thus, it is extremely likely she was killed around that time. So her baby would be... Just turning 18. Huh. How can she stay so calm? What could it be? The thing is, I don't know how much detail that she knew about this, so how does she... Oh 
Well, what do you think she knows? I'm not sure how much she knew, to be honest. She knew she was dead somehow. But did she know where she was this whole time? Well, I'll try it, I guess. Maybe. No, that's irrelevant. <laughs> the information on her? Because okay. that body isn't Iris. And you know it. Are you serious? Yes. Her name is Monica EY. Also, she was so killed like it's when she was 19. In a bit since we've discovered the body. And if Boss does not know that that's not Iris, it means they have not fingerprinted that body. I guess not. <laughs> she went to the same high school as you, and she was your best friend. Mm -hmm. Isn't that Oh. Nothing to say. Isn't that right? Yeah. Hiding right. something? Maybe you killed her with Renju. That's ridiculous. Oh, now you're talking. <laughs> we know Renju committed a crime. Illegally disposing of a body. And we can prove it. Well, it's not fully disposing. No, he's preserving it. That's a big difference. <laughs> Very big difference. Yeah. No, oh, why would Renju be questioned about dumping a body? Oh, for the location, I would assume. Okay. <laughs> Cold storage warehouse where the body was found. It's been managed by Renju Okiura for almost two decades now. Like, if you wanted to get rid of that body, you had plenty of opportunity to. The witness testimony proves that he knew about the corpse there. And if I'm not mistaken, you knew about the corpse too, Hitomi. You and Renju have been close since high school. It's not too much of a stretch to think that he told you about the body. And I remember you telling me once. When I was young, I... I lost someone very important to me. Monica Ui, my best friend. One of the only friends I had. How did you know that she was dead? I didn't. Don't play dumb. I know you're hiding something. You know what happened 18 years ago. And you knew she was pregnant. You were her best friend. Of course you would have known. Tell me. Tell me everything. Date, she's not going to talk. Sync with her. All right. Got to do it. Got to sync with I her. I got to think about it first. No, wait. <laughs> No, I didn't do my own joke. Okay. I gotta I'm think sure about it first. I've told you enough times by now, but please <sighs> JPEG. come back within six minutes. I know, I Peter. I can't promise you that, Peter. Oh, we're gonna stay longer. What do you mean? I mean, I'm not coming back until I find something. Dante, you can't. Oh. Why not? You know why. Because it will take over my consciousness? Yes. But if it's only a little. No, it's a little conscious a little. to take over. If the sink passes the critical point, the damage will be irreparable. But what does that mean exactly? Uh, no one actually knows what that means. Just don't do it. We gotta do it at least once to find out. You know, we can't do it. Right, right. No. I'm not hiding anything. No, clearly Pewter. not. Let's try You're so Let's unconvincing, Pewter. He's as convincing as Michael. Then we'll know for sure what'll happen. Uh, fine. <laughs> I'll just say it. Yeah? Huh? Pewter, tell him. Me? You know more yeah. about it than I do. <sighs> well... Fine, I'll do it. Peter, tell him. What happens? Well, first off, six minutes is not a hard limit. It's actually quite it soft. Could be seven or yeah. eight. I don't care about the exact time. I'm asking what happens if you go beyond the limit. Do you remember the story I told you about the egg? No, I have a terrible yeah, memory. If you imagine an egg as your consciousness, the 
Yolk is what goes into the subject's brain. The white I am an egg. inside your shell. If you go beyond the limit, your yolk will not be able to return to its shell. Because the subject's mind will start to take over the sinker's consciousness, right? I know that part already. Indeed. <laughs> but there's more to it. After the yolk is devoured, the egg white is brought through the machine next. Huh? And there's more. It's not just the sinker's brain. The same process eventually occurs in the subjects as well. In other uh. words, the entire egg ends up being replaced. Mind, consciousness, memory, they are traded. Switched. The human brain has what can be understood as a memory limit. One brain can only hold one consciousness. And it can only contain Which, one like, person. Which, like, not minds. exactly. That's not Peter. Who should I ask first? Anything else? Now you know more. Know everything. Talk to the boss. Oh. Why do he have to say it so sensually? I don't know. That's a good question. Peter's a sensual dude. He can't help it. It's just in his nature. Also, like, do you like that you're still on good terms with Peter because you don't know at all that he was behind that attack on you and Iris? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. No hard feelings, I guess. Sure. I would forgive him. I already have. I mean, what? I don't remember that happening. It never happened. Come here, Peter. I'd give you a good a little kissy <laughs> on the cheek. We because you're gay and don't go that way. System could be exploited. <laughs> exploited? But... Even if it wasn't you, someone else might try. We didn't tell any sinkers... No, he's try. You. Can't believe this. A project sink is a <laughs> top secret project. It's a matter of national security. Even sinkers are on a need-to-know basis. Think about it. What if you were kidnapped by bad people who tried to make you talk? Bad people? A criminal organization, <laughs> spies from another country, those people. If you blabbed about Project Sink, the entire country might be at risk. You heard it from Pewter. Project the Sink. The sink machine isn't just for entering a person's somnium. It can also be used to swap bodies between two people. Imagine what this that, machine would be used for. In that's some sci-fi stuff. Mm. Imagine if they got that's used that way. That's why I didn't tell you. We can't let this secret get out. You could uh get into a huge breast body and uh Ooh. and feel the breasts whenever you like. Well, let's not tell Dante about that. Between two people. <laughs> <laughs> To me. He's just like, don't even talk to me. Yeah, yeah, I got it. It's like, yeah, I'm listening. I can get into that body and touch those breasts. <laughs> I'd okay? like to touch Hitomi's body, yeah. <laughs> I'm fine. Start it. Okay, so this is like the hardest to navigate sink in the whole game. Oh no. Well, this will be a challenge then. Maybe. I am beautiful looking place. God. I am the <laughs> god of fire. I burn erotic books with my flames of red oh. hot anger. Oh, we don't like that. Ooh. <laughs> ah.
Why? Are you okay? It's a bit of a rough start. Hurt. I'll let you read this porno mag if it'll make you feel better. I will. So generous. No. The fog is making it pitch Ooh, black. I'm getting a bit of lag here. Uh-oh. Are we all right? Let me here? uh just stop watching for a second and then restart the feed. Stop watching my stream. How dare you? The light over okay. there. Is that a firefly? Okay, what day is it? Tuesday? I think Tuesday. It is. It's Activate. Tuesday. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Whoa. What secrets do you hold? Secrets. Secrets. Secret secrets. <laughs> it disappeared? No, wait. It might still be nearby. What is it? Okay. So... Yes, do your save as usual. Mm -hmm. And also, I'd like you to take a look at the map. Because of this course. is something you should do often here. Right now, we only have the flower blood, blood that I we can interact with. But yeah, other things will show up. It will stay this dark the entire time. A so use the map liberally. The variety. Are we going to have Slender Man on this map? No. It okay. looks like it, though. Okay, so... This is the only thing to int interact Light it with. up. A flower bud. I cannot identify the variety. I guess smell the flower? I mean, people get enlightened from worshipping, like doing some religious practices. Mm, I see. Worship it? Yeah. I will pray to it as though I am mourning the dead. That's an option. Oh. It bloomed a little? I don't know what caused it, but it's better than nothing happening. Huh. I guess we lit it up. Mm-hmm. Oh, we got All some right. rocks and a hole. So apparently wow. you can get a nice timey somewhere. Um, It's not necessary, but, you know, y you might like having it. You want to go to rock too? Yeah, I guess. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's a big rock in the way. What do we have at rock two? And this oh. is another worship. Okay. But it's a rock. Gods live in the rocks yeah. too, you know. You never know where you'll find your next god. Japanese way of thinking. Just try it. If you insist. Where is this game made, Iva? <laughs> How was it? You've cleared your head, right? Yes. I now feel a sense of emptiness. Guess it was a waste of time. <laughs> I do not want to hear that from you. I feel so targeted. Okay. So the actual uh, thing... Yeah, I you got it. I I a different looking thing. Mm-hmm. 
Oh, we could tackle the hole. I will say this is not the hole you need to tackle. Oh, okay. Uh, hmm. Should we stick our hand in? You want to grope around inside that hole? I mean, I'm not going to go ahead and say that's my instinct is to stick something in it, but, um. But, like. That was what I was thinking. Yeah. Why not? All right. Just go ahead. I am not going to be eaten or anything, right? Probably not. Maybe. Whoa. Oh, we just got sucked in. Uh, they usually go together, right? Fell, but I, I guess. <laughs> it's darker than before. What? Is someone there? Hey. That voice hey. is. Find out where that voice is coming from. Sounds like a a young and handsome oh, Renju. No. Oh, there's a okay. Renju on the map. Go There's a wrench on the map. You want to navigate towards him. What does that say? There's wrench you. <laughs> can't read. Oh, there he is. This, yeah, you should use the map liberally. Hi there. Renju Okiura. How you been? Oh, wait. Sorry, I him? forgot. We had to do another oh. hole in a tree. Oh. You could flirt with him just for fun, though. Sure, why not? Yoo-hoo, Renju. This is what you really want the whole time, me. huh? Come get some of this. <laughs> Should we just enjoy this animation for a second? Would you want to come get some of this? <laughs> Nano, are you still there? Do you want to come get some of this? Come on. It's an option. Oh my! Sorry, Damn, that was a bad idea. she is really upset. She's not getting some. Don't apologize. This is Renju's fault for having bad taste. <laughs> I really wanted to get some. Wow. <laughs> Five minutes left, Ate. Okay, okay. Uh, so we had to go to another hole first. Oh, hole number another two. Another hole. How many holes do we have to go into? There Where's you go. this hole? Find your hole. I can't find the hole. Where's it? Then you gotta feel around first. Oh, there it is. Just follow the trail. You can. You don't like being singled out for this now, Trites? You pleasantly <laughs> decline. <laughs> All right. Looks about as big around as a soccer ball. I just had to figure out who was here to still like um. Ask about. Hey, uh, what was your first instinct? Oh, you mean when I was joking about tackling it last time? Yeah, now you can tackle well, it. Now I can actually tackle it. Let's tackle this hole. Understood. I will do my best. Charge right in. We're too big. This is a picture of Hitomi, Renju, and Monica. Everyone is so young. Hold on to that. Well, she didn't love to get very old. Fortunately. Mm -mm. Now, now you can go to Renju. There you are. That handsome man. How convenient. Got lights on the way. Renju He's Okira. lit. Ah. None of these really use a lot of time. Do we have a bunch later they can use a lot of time? I know the last one's supposed to use a lot of time. Alright, we'll save these for now. So, let, let's Look save your half one until something is at least 30 seconds. Yeah. I don't want to see this. Bye. Wait! <laughs> <laughs> Renju, stop! He's not stopping. And stop won't stop. Oh, we shook him. Got shook real good. The All right. Properly shook. Oh, we got whole one again. Like and two. Yeah. 
three. But like not hole in tree one. It's just hole one. Uh, yeah. We like holes a lot. I know. We keep going in them. I recommend hole. Oh, there it is. Because you two are a hole. This hole? It wasn't here earlier. No comment. <laughs> oh, we got a 30 second one. Oh, go for it. We'll cut you down a little bit. Really? Just jump wide in. Yeah, go ahead. It's wide open. Understood. Let's not yours mess began. Oh. oh, here we are again. 72 uh, hours remain. <laughs> Another voice? Monica! That's Hitomi's voice. Where is she? Look for Where her. Where'd she be? Young Hitomi. Sounds hot. Oh, another hole. Um, let's see what next. I'm getting hole in tree three. I see it. On my list. It was all down hole from here. Mm-hmm. Another hole in a tree. About as big as a capybara, I estimate. Good measurement. That big. hole is the, the perfect size to, to do something. The perfect size. Mm. I, don't know. I don't think we can tackle that one up there. We can try to peek inside. Are we gonna peek you in, this, want... in this hole? I I would be a little unhinged and scream in it. Oh. I've never screamed at a hole, but okay. Hitomi! <laughs> Date likes Hitomi. Oh. Hey, what are you trying to say? Hitomi won't remember this sink. Maybe she will. But still. <laughs> She'll remember this one part only. Oh, look at her. Hitomi, stop. Young Hitomi. We're still doing stuff with the oh, tree. Oh, she is. Oh, we're, we're not still done interacting here. with a hole? hole in a tree. Yeah. Now that you've warmed it up, now you can stick your hand in. Thanks for the advice. I won't get in, right? <laughs> you have to uh, sweet talk the tree first oh, before uh, entering. Uh -huh. Oh, we got something A from it. Cord bracelet has appeared on my wrist. Perhaps it belongs to someone. The tree gave you a friendship bracelet. <laughs> friends forever. The tree said, "I'm friend zoning you." Aww. This was too sappy. Thank you, Vice. <laughs> now go see your crush. Well, Date's crush at least. What you doing? That's Hitomi. Looking for someone? Look what I got. Should we hug her first? <laughs> or touch her? How about you save and then do all of them? We might actually need the time. Okay, we'll be reasonable about this. I have to see what happens. Thank you. Oh, I appreciate it. There we go. Do all of them. Do it. That's Hitomi. I see. Touch her. Well, we we start with talking, not touching. Okay, fine. Hitomi. What are you doing here? We're gonna do them all anyway. Guess she can't hear you. Okay. She looks like she's nope. looking for something. All right, she doesn't want to talk to us. That's Fine. That's Hitomi. Three Let minutes, touch. Dante. Where? Good question. Well, um... No, Date. Could, you know, touch her... But in this <laughs> Somnium, she might be a minor. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Her stomach. Test how soft her stomach is. Uh huh. If you say so. Oh. Well, it was I fun. Touched it. So, what's the softness situation? Tell me. It was soft, nice and pliant, no noticeable abdominal muscles. Mm. Valuable information indeed. Thank you, Iba. You old. Perfect. Date. 
<laughs> so, so long. That's Hitomi. Hi, Hitomi. Do you want a hug? Hitomi? Hmm, I see. Well? She looks so awkward right now. <laughs> she dresses modestly, but underneath she has a curvaceous body. Well, now we're getting some information. Good work, Aiba. That's good to know. <laughs> Okay. Probably should reload now from that. Actually, if we touch her, we get a really good timing. Maybe I should reload that. Oh, wait, I can't reload. I have to go out here first. That's right. Yeah, that was like 45 seconds wasted. Yeah, just in case. We might need it. It might be valuable. Well, we always have time for touching it, Tommy, apparently. Yeah, yeah, I know seen this just played this today you heard it here first folks yeah He'll I remember always make time everything. that's a to to touch you told me well um, you but in <laughs> just touch a to soft little tummy I touched yeah. so it was found you Oh, so I'll suddenly one fourth. Oh, that's so bad. Here you go. Have a bracelet. Do you, remember you like this? bracelets, right? I love bracelets. Oh, let's I not gotta explain. go. <laughs> See you later. So far, these haven't used too much time. A lot of them have individually used up a lot of time, anyway. Oh, another hole. Okay. Um, hole number two is calling our name. There it is. A large hole. Was mm. this here before? Let's just shorten them up. If there is nothing left to do. Pop. What could go wrong? Oopsie daisy. Gotta land on your feet. What is going on? I don't know. It's pitch black. I can't see anything. I see. Then it is not me malfunctioning. Can you feel your way around? I can try. Thought I just like, what else can you feel? Cl <laughs> Cluster? Cluster Amaryllis. No, oh, over there. That's the only thing on the map. Where there's light. Well, hello there, Cluster. Flower. Oh, we can worship this one. 15 seconds. Uh, oh, and so we time. will not want to worship it for once. Of course not. Are we digging it? Yeah. Okay. I dig it. Let's do it. I wish we had a pickaxe though. Wh what? Uh, you can use your bare hands. Mm. Another hole. <sighs> this is a very a holy stream. Two minutes, Date. Hurry. You know what you want to do. Use our timey. We've come this far. I will not protest now. I don't need to know about coming anymore. this far. Dramatic. Congratulations. We should have did a whole nother world. That is... Ah. Yep, they found her.
the idea would be something like that, yeah. A lot of stuff with holes. <laughs> Lots of holes. Tell me. I think I know what happened 18 years ago. Mm hmm You three were close. You, Monica, and Renju. Monica was murdered. You and Renju found the body in the mountains. And you brought it back to the cold storage warehouse. My guess is so Sejima killed Monica. Mm -hmm. That's why I figured it's blackmail, huh? Mm. I've seen inside his head before using this machine. I see. If you know that much, then there's no point in hiding it anymore. I'll tell you the truth. Oh. Very forthcoming all of a sudden. Let's go. Yeah. She's a nice lady. 18 years ago. Wait, you're going to see so? Yes. I want to talk to him in person. No, you can't. Why not? Are you worried about my body? You don't have to worry about that. I'm totally fine. But your stomach is still... Oh, my doctor told me that's normal. Your stomach doesn't go down right away after giving birth. I'm not worried about your body. Uh, I don't know how to explain it. So doesn't care about you. And especially not your child. I haven't told him about giving birth. He contacted me for the first time in a while. So that's why. He wants to know about the baby. He must be panicking. If anyone ever finds out his mistress had his baby, his political career would be over. It's not like it was an affair. His wife passed away after giving birth to his son, right? It would still be a big scandal. He impregnated a girl who just graduated high school. Don't you see how that looks? He knew how the public would take it. That's why he gave you the money to deal with it. There's no way he'll accept that child. It's okay. I told him that I won't cause any trouble. Very naive. But could you take care of the baby? Just for a little bit? I'll be right back. Fine. But take this with you, just in case. Oh. It's a GPS transmitter. Just to be extra safe. I really don't think I'll need it. But okay, if... It'll make you feel better. It will. Significantly. Pretty similar. I don't know what Monica saw in So. She said he was kind and... Me loved, neither. That he wanted to change his <laughs> Seriously. But I didn't understand any of it. He tried to convince her to break up with him so many times. She never listened. And it ended in tragedy. What happened next, you already know. Neither Renju or I saw it happen, so I don't know how much of this is accurate, but we could guess what happened.
Так. He told her to move overseas. He said he'd pay for everything. Renju told me. But you said he wasn't there. He heard some of this from the Kumakuras. Renju had connections with them. How did the Kumakuras know? So told them. Date. You said that Monica was killed by So, right? But that's not true. Monica was killed by Saito Sajima, the son of So and his late wife. Uh -oh. Saito was twelve at the time. Twelve? Yes. He was young and impressionable. How did a boy, do that. I guess so. I don't know. I can't imagine. It was complicating so things a little bit. Friend, the chairman of the Kumakuras. He asked him to dispose of the body and left the scene with Saito. The incident was 18 years ago. Yeah. That means the chairman was Rohan, not Mona. Oh, okay, yeah. Rohan yeah. went to the scene of the crime? Yes, with some of his men. Again, neither Renju or I saw this. We were just waiting at my house for Monica to return. But she never came back. We tried to call her cell, but it didn't connect. But then, we saw movement on the GPS. The GPS Renju gave to Monica? Yes. At first, we thought she was on her way home. But we saw the GPS getting further and further away from the city. Renju and I got nervous, and we decided to follow it. What about the baby? We couldn't take the baby with us, so... Renju gave the baby to the mob doctor he trusted. Oh. Sometimes you just gotta... do that. Sometimes you gotta put your trust in the mob doctor. Those are Kumakura men. We didn't dare move. We couldn't speak. We were barely breathing. We could only watch as it all unfolded. I knew what the hole was for, but I couldn't move. Couldn't do anything. I remember my heart beating so fast. Before long. We good here? Yeah. Cover her. Just a minute. <laughs> Your face. <laughs> All right. The Kumakura people covered Monica's body. You're not yourself when you're hungry. Renju and I ran over. Um, nom nom nom. <laughs> tree branch. What? We saw. Tasty. Monica. You're not making this any better for yourself. <laughs> no, no, no. We need to. We need to call the police. No, no police. No, we can't. Not yet. You don't know who those guys are. They would do anything to keep this hidden. I've seen it happen myself. I know what they're capable of. Anyway, think about it. Why would they do this? They thought Monica and her baby were going to be trouble. Monica's stomach was still pretty big. I don't think they know that she gave birth already. What do you think they'd do if they found out? 
they would take her and kill her too. And then, they'd come for us. They'd make it look like we disappeared. All of us would be... gone. Renju convinced me. He knew more about the dirty underbelly of society than anyone. He knew when something couldn't be handled by the police. He said that they would do anything to kill the child. And I believed him. We had to protect Monica's baby. We had to. No matter what. Okay. I understand. I decided to trust him. He's gonna work very quickly to figure out he has to put this on ice. Oh, there we go. We couldn't leave Monica's body in the forest. We cleaned her up and took her to the cold storage warehouse. This warehouse is owned by Okiura Fishery. My father runs it. But it's not in use right now. They're moving operations to a better area. They're actually looking for buyers right now. But don't worry. I'll take over the warehouse. Are you sure? Yes. Don't worry. I'll keep everyone out. Everyone but you, of course. I'll give you a key. You can come visit any time you want to see Monica. It's a little creepy, but all right. Monica, don't worry about the baby. I'll protect her no matter what. And don't worry about them either. The people who did this to you, I will never forgive them. I'm sorry, Monica. Good, don't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Monica. Oh. We get oh. to see Renju more. We got a little baby. So far. Monica's baby, sleeping soundly. She has a sweet scent, a scent that touches the bottom of my heart. Cute sleeping face. Oh, shoebox. Oh, we're not thinking anything perverted. <laughs> <laughs> wow, place looks so similar all these years ago. Hey, Renju. Oh yeah, where were you? Did you get a birth certificate? The mob doctor took care of everything. Oh, I have good to know the mob doctors. And I even picked up a mother and baby book. Mm -hmm. It wasn't cheap, but you don't have to worry about it. Mm -hmm. Just submit the birth certificate and everything will be taken care of. You look worried. I feel like... I'm somehow betraying Monica. She was the one who gave birth. Soon, you won't even be able to think about that. Because a war is about to begin. A war? Between you and the baby. You won't get a good night's sleep so for true. a long time. You might even start to resent Monica for all this. Oh. Really? Anyway, as soon as you submit the certificate, you will officially be her mother. Be sure to raise her responsibly. I'll help. Occasionally. Hmm. Occasionally, huh? I always see what kind of father he ends up making. <laughs> he does really to clearly this, care for Iris, though. Hmm. There's something you need to know. Yeah. After talking to the Kumakura gang, I found out who killed Monica. Mm-hmm. So son, Saito Sejima. 
How? The mint you've never met. Twelve years old. Why? Why would a little boy do that? He must be some kind of sick pervert. I don't know the motive, but I know it's true. So used his connections with the Kumakuras to cover up for a son. And all of the evidence of this scandal, of course. I'll never forgive them. So, his son, or the Kumakuras. I feel the same way. But you can't think about revenge now. You and the baby can't lead a life like that. <laughs> Just bear with it for now. The opportunity will come. So wait until the right moment. Okay? I was thinking about her name. How about Iris? Iris? The goddess of rainbows in Greek mythology? And the colored part of your eye. And the flower, too. Right. I thought it might have something to do with your name, Hitomi. <laughs> Not only that, it's also for Monica's name. The kanji for Monica uses the character for love. And Monica reminds me of Monaco, Japanese for eye. So both names have something to do with the eye. And I, which means love, will always be a part of Iris. So that's how you came up with the name? They really went deep on that name making. There's a lot into that, yeah. Iris. Iris. Yeah. What's in a name? I really like it. And so my life with Iris began. Raising a child was much harder than I expected. Uh-oh. It's starting. Waking up in the middle of the night to change diapers or feed her. <laughs> Iris wasn't a good sleeper. I had to sing her lullabies to put her to sleep. And I always needed to put her to bed so carefully. It would only take 10 seconds before she'd start crying again. So I had to pick her up, sing her another lullaby, then put her back to bed. After doing this over and over, before I knew it, the morning sun would creep in through the windows. But even with all that, I cherished every single day. My hatred for those responsible never went away. But my hands were full, raising Iris. I devoted myself to her. I never thought about anything else. Eventually, my desire for revenge just faded away. Mama! Mama! Woof! Woof! <laughs> <laughs> Good yeah, job, this Iris. uh, I'm wet. She's trying. Aww. Mommy, I won race today. Good Is job. Is proud of me? No. Mommy, Aww. I want to see Milky Moon Always again. Always proud. Milky Moon? Mommy, you are so good at dancing. That's this universe's version of Sailor Moon. Ah. Mommy, pancakes are done! Sorry, I burned it a little. <laughs> of course you did. Mommy, why can't I dance at the stores? I can't help it! My body dances on its own! <laughs> Mommy, don't more people come to barbecues? How come it's always you and me? Aww. Hey, Mommy. How long will it take my bone to get better? I want to dance again with everybody. Hey, Mommy, do you like my shirt? Look, we're matching. Mommy, thank you for everything. I love you more than anything in the whole wide world. Mommy, look. I drew it. <laughs> <laughs> the Okonomiyaki War, huh? That was so fun! We should do it again! The food or the food fight? Um... Of oh! course both. I'm gonna have to say no to the latter, sweetie. It took forever to clean. But Uncle said he 
he wants to do it again, too. Well, maybe Uncle's a little irresponsible. He could be a little irresponsible. It's part of the charm. Yes. Are you gonna maybe Uncle's a murderous freak. We all have our flaws. What, <laughs> what are you talking about? There's so much you're willing to overlook. <laughs> as long as it's Uncle, I'm I didn't say I was willing to overlook it. I say go for it. <laughs> I will always question myself. Could I keep living a lie? I had promised Monica that I would avenge her. But I couldn't work up the courage. And maybe Renju was exaggerating. But there's no statute of limitations for murder in Japan. Oh, if we right. showed Monica's body to the police, so would be punished by the law. And the Sejima's and Kumakura's crimes would be uncovered. But that would mean... Iris's secret would be uncovered as well. That's what I was really worried about. I didn't want Iris to know that So was her father. And even more than that, Who would want to know that So was their father? Yeah. I know that I'm not her real mother. That's the real reason I've been silent for 18 years. I didn't want to lose Iris. But... Fate can be cruel. Apparently so. God used other means to take Iris from me. In January, Iris suddenly collapsed. It was caused by a malignant tumor in her brain. There's nothing we can do. She only has a year to live at most. That's what the doctor said. If you remember me telling you. But what I didn't tell you is that there was an experimental new treatment. It was. Some of the cutting-edge nanomachines can even go inside your body and cure illnesses. They can even cure like cancer. Boo -boo or something. Beep, beep, beep. That's beep, what beep, mom beep. said. I think she could have beep beeped a little better. Nanomachines. Maybe. Nanomachines, son. Nanomachines could remove the tumor. But the procedure would be so expensive. With my salary, it wasn't something I could afford. I thought hard about it, about how I could get my hands on that kind of money, but I couldn't think of a solution. Time passed. Before I knew it, it was November. Iris's symptoms worsened. Her time was running out. I was starting to panic. I couldn't sit here and waste time while Iris... In any case, I had to get the money. Before it was too late. So I thought of a plan. A plan to blackmail So Tsujima. Yep. I figure it's going to come yeah. this. That's why they were... Two days ago, on Saturday night, I called So and invited him to come to the warehouse. He agreed to come. After I hinted at what happened 18 years ago, I had prepared everything, hiding behind the forklift until So came. When he finally arrived, he walked over to the workbench where I had laid Monica's body. He lifted the cloth and looked down. He whimpered and stumbled back. Oh and no! Faced, seeing a body he thought he got rid of 18 years ago. Not to mention it was the body of a woman he was in a relationship with. A woman his own. I ejaculated with. into that. Excuse me? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's accurate for so! He reacted exactly yeah. as I expected he would. Yeah. I was just not expecting to hear those words at that moment. And sent it to his phone. <laughs> I was thinking it for a few seconds before I said mm. it. Okay.
<laughs> Nano Troids. What? Nano Troids is like, ew. <laughs> Thank you for having my back, Nano. Would you like to play a game? Oh, you're gonna love next game. They use this uh, voice uh -oh. uh, alterer a lot more in that. Ooh, good. I told him to keep quiet and cut ties with the Kumakuras. Even if he found out who I was, without the Kumakura gang, he had no power over me. And there's no way he'd risk his political career. Not to go after me. I saw So put his phone back into his pocket and run out of the warehouse. I came out of my hiding place to put Monica's body back. But... Then, something unexpected happened. An unexpected Date. <laughs> I saw you, Date. I hid behind the forklift before you saw me. And when you were done looking around... I saw you look around with your one non-colorful eye. <laughs> Can't be. Iris. Not Iris. Uh oh. I was losing consciousness. My head felt fuzzy. I couldn't gather my thoughts. I didn't know what to say. Instead, Iba did the talking. Well, thank you, Iba. Iris is not Hitomi's daughter. Yes, thank you for clarifying. But Iris's father <laughs> is Sosajima. Right. Unfortunately. Her mother, Monica Very, Iba, very unfortunate. Very, years ago by So's son, Saito. Very, very, very unfortunate. However, Hitomi raised Iris since she was a baby. Oh, there's two Hitomis right next to each other. <laughs> it's mm, like, who is this Hitomi so you're speaking of? And compassion for her. Just as much as her biological mother would have, if not more. Iris's tumor was discovered in January of this year. The only possible treatment was experimental nanotechnology. However, that treatment is restrictively expensive. Hideo Kojima's hoarding them all. Hitomi devised a plan to blackmail Sosajima for the money. Mm. The best way to establish the blackmail was to show him proof directly. That is why Hitomi created the scene with the corpse. She was the one who called So to the warehouse. On Sunday night, what Date saw was what Hitomi had prepared for So. That is the summary of what we have learned so far. But there are well, some you, things Emma. I have yet to understand. Date, uh -oh. pull yourself together. Ask her questions. Can't pull myself together. I'm a mess. Date, stop staring at her Date, tits. Out of it. I heard I have a calm for me and came to. Bye, Tommy. Well, I'm... There's gonna be a lot to get through here. This is... Well, we certainly learned a lot more than uh, anything else You know what's funny? Here. Yeah? I think you just talk to her a little bit more and then you're gonna hit a lock. Oh. Should we do this? We Maybe we should try talking to her because I know it locks really soon. Hmm. Well, let's ask That's the up most. to you. Sorry. We'll keep going. I have no idea. It's just what he was into. He was hungry. Simple. Uh. 
Yeah, that's a good question. Did you tell Renju about this, or did no, you just do this on your own? I did oh. not. Oh. This was my idea. Okay. I probably don't have to ask, but let me just be sure. After I left the warehouse, what did you do? I put Monica's body back onto the hood of the forklift. Then, I left. Makes sense. Yeah. Keep it clean. That's why the police didn't see the body when they arrived on the scene. It makes perfect sense now that I have the facts. Right. Iris did not resurrect. You simply mistook Monica for Iris. I'm an idiot. The body did not disappear. Hitomi moved it. Those were the events at the warehouse Sunday night. Simple. Summarize. There are still a few loose ends, but I believe I understand what occurred 18 years ago. Do you understand it all? However, none of this ties directly back to Shoko Nadani. I was gonna say... Her murder was just four days ago. The Shoko thing mm -hmm. I'm so curious about. Is it yeah. connected? It's interesting timing. Or are these two separate cases? If there is a connection, it would be with Renju and So. can think about it later. More importantly. I headed for the exit. Wait. Oh. Sorry. Where are you going? To look for Iris. Uh, but you have do no my idea job. where she is, right? Do you know something? What do you know? Yes. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh. Oh. I was trying to say I could see my buddies back there, but I guess... Guess not. No. No Boston one can Twitter. help you no now. Be seen. Oh, wait, they're gone? Where did they go? <laughs> Where did oh. they go? Well, that's concerning. What the that's hell? That's spooky. I don't like the sound of that. Okay, it's told me. What's up? She's standing there creepily. At around four o'clock today, I received a phone call. I don't know who it was. They were using a voice oh, no. modulator. What did they say? Everyone has a voice modulator now. I have your daughter. Mm -hmm. Don't call the police or she dies. That's why I didn't tell you earlier. Of course. Renju. We don't know that for certain. It could be number 89. Oh. Either way. Could be. Iris Look is in danger right now. What else do you have? The voice asked for something else. He told me to go to a specified location with you. With me? Yes. The culprit knows me? It must be Renju. Mm. It's Everyone always about me. you, Date. <laughs> location. Well, location. I'm sorry, but this stops now. Pewter! Oh my god. Again. Boss! You too? Oh, did you get shot? Date. Oh my Ray. god. Fucking Boss, Pewter! I can't believe you checked for them. <laughs> Please, do not worry. Do not worry, motherfucker. Her to sleep. What are you doing? My orders. They told us to halt our investigation. Never trust the guys wearing an outfit like the boss this. Boss was already going <laughs> against orders as it is, which is why. Investigation. What investigation? Shoko or Iris? Neither. Uh -oh. the investigation of Monica's murder. Oh shit. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah you know. Monica? But her case has all but completely solved. <laughs> Date. Oh, God. Yes, but only to us, right? If we say nothing, then her investigation is ongoing. So, Sejima. So threatened us, didn't he? I don't know. You made me just a teeny weeny threat. You stripped of your authority on this investigation. As of five minutes ago. Damn. In fact. 
you are to be placed under house arrest. House arrest? <laughs> oh no. But you know my house is like it. nothing. I suggest you comply. Let's be on his computer all day. And you know what that means. Iva, can you turn the power off? Easily. Alright, get ready. Oh Three, no, two, because he's happily one. in a relationship. He wouldn't do the first thing I thought of. Mmm. Damn. Oh no, Ooh. I have no night vision. <laughs> oh, there we go. Get in the closet and weave. <laughs> now tell me, where is the location? I can't tell you. Why not? It's making this very if difficult. I told you, you'd go alone, wouldn't you? No, I'm totally bringing you. But if I don't go with you... All right, take me there. Hmm. Ooh. Oh no, the abandoned factory. It's real close, man. I know this place. It's the chemical plant that closed eight years ago. I knew that. How did I know that? The corners of my mind were aching. Date, the sorry. internet. My head is pounding. This is going to be bad. Yeah, it what is. Happened? Someone has begun to access my stored memory. Oh no. We're getting hacked. All the data. Everything I have accumulated over the last five years, including backups. Pewter. Is Pewter doing this? Almost definitely. Motherfucker. He does have admin rights. Turn off your Wi-Fi. I summoned some ice, but that will only buy time. I have four hours at the most. After my ice is broken, Peter will be able to access Wadget, my core programming. He would be able to destroy my mind. Don't let it melt. Why? It must be related to the orders they are receiving from the top. The higher-ups clearly see you as a threat, Dante. They are attempting to limit your power by removing me from the equation. I suppose their motivation hardly matters now. The most important thing now is finding Iris and bringing her to Abyss within four hours. Or else... You know, sounds... possible. I will cease to exist. Alright. Date? Better get going. Nothing. Just... Oh, everything is I'm fine. Having Don't a... worry. Deep conversation with my eye. I'm counting on you, Date. My eye's gonna be deleted if we don't hurry. <laughs> Trust me, it makes sense. Four hours, it's fine. That should be plenty of time, right? What could possibly go wrong? It's been such an uneventful week. I gripped my evolver and got moving. This is the worst game of hide and seek ever. I'll go in first. What's behind door number Wait one? Here. Okay. Oh. All right, Date. How how smart are you? Oh yes. Also, this. Renju. Oh, not again. Oh, you... You gotta be kidding me. You. Me. Well, that's a cliffhanger. Yeah. Yep. Uh, you were so close to it, so... You, you just you needed us. a little push. <laughs> Perfect. Got him. This case remains unsolved. <laughs> How will I ever solve this? Uh, you know how when she ran away from the hospital? Mm hmm He he really needed to stay in a hospital. Just stayed where he was. Probably been better for everyone. Well maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure how this is gonna end. Ooh. But um 
unfortunately, yeah. there We're is locked. no happy ending where we can have a lovely living Renju. No. Summer just faded to cease, I guess. Yeah. Well, I guess we have a uh, a spot to jump off from once again, according to this. I wonder how that's going to end for us. <laughs> Looks promising. Well, the thing that you're going to is going to be the worst possible outcome. But yeah. you're going to learn everything. A necessary step along the way. So Sometimes um, things have to get have... worse before they get better. What? Do you have any... Uh... Like theories, working theories, partially working theories, now that you're like right before them spelling it out for you? Um, I do. I don't really want to go over them just now because I'm actually getting tired. Tired? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, well, we can talk about this either on Discord or, uh, at the beginning of the next one we do this if you want. Just go over some, uh, yeah. Things that I've been yeah, we should of. just have theory time. Also, look at the little yeah. spiral the the roots make now. They make a little twirl. Yeah, it's cute. Yeah. It's, I I wonder. Yeah. I like the colors. Um. Yeah. What I was gonna say is uh. Yeah, there was a. A whole big section there, obviously, in this one where we got a lot of information that clarified a lot of stuff and gives you more mm -hmm. to think about. So um, I was mostly quiet through it, but you know, there's a lot that I could say on that. Uh, and I will when I'm able to uh, properly be rested and able to function. <laughs> I just anyway. can't wait for you to finally get your confirmation of just... Mm -hmm. Like, what was going on with the polar bear and each instance of the polar bear existing? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, it's Monokuma, obviously. Yeah. You know, he had a Just like in a somewhere. polar bear suit instead of a. Well, you gotta a, switch things up. Right whatever well. his. Yeah. I can't believe he called it Grizzly. Clearly not a grizzly bear. That was just no. so wrong in every level. It's really polarizing, actually. It is. I agree with Nanotreads, so it's clear that a murder has occurred somewhere in this. Uh, murder has occurred. I know, I know that's happened, at least. I'm, I'm fairly sure of that. Me too. I think we call it murder at this point. Probably wasn't an accident. Well, anyway. Okay, it was I'm gonna a slip-up? It was a slip-up. It was a slip-and-fall. You know, one of those accidental mm -hmm. things when they don't de-ice the sidewalk. All right, I'm, I'm cutting this off. You guys all have a good night. Bye-bye. Later. Next time. Peace.